Thank you.
Hey, everybody. Oh, what's up? How are you? Are you here? I am here. I keep forgetting to put it in the description. This song, this music, is a, a guy named Northnan. N O R T H N A N. Northnan. He. De it's a whole album of uh, Animal Crossing. Uh, K K Slider covers, and it's exceptional. And it's my official starting soon slash BRB music. So yeah, hey everybody. How's a going? I hope it's a going well. Looks like a lot of people doing good. Having a good time other than recovering from the flu. That's no fun. It's that season though. It is that season. I have not gotten sick yet this year. This season. I used to get sick all the time. Especially around this time of year. Constantly, constantly sick. And, uh... Since then, I had my... Adenoids removed. Which I, I think, uh... Might have caused a lot of sinus infections. And I also started eating well and have, like... Lost a bunch of weight and am just a lot healthier. And I don't know if one or both of those is contributing, but I've just not been getting sick. I haven't gotten sick since then, which is just crazy. Like, there was a while I was getting sick every month. It was terrible. Lawrence Hot Hugh Burns, what is up? Not here for Pokemon, here for Arlo. You're so sweet. You're too sweet. You're so sweet. Well, I'm here for Pokemon! No, everyone's getting sick, though. Yeah, I mean, my friends, their whole family, stomach bug. Not even, like, seasonal, you know, cold or whatever. Like, stomach bug, too, on top of that. It's just, like, really? It's crazy. It's awful. I have not been able to play this DLC at all. A lot of, lot of first-timers. Hey, everybody. I'm glad you been are able to catch me here. I wanted to stream on Friday, and then I kept trying to stream other days, and it was really frustrating, and things kept happening. And then I, <laughs> I was get, I was all ready to stream. I had told Twitter and everything, and uh, I remembered at the last minute that my nephew had been using the Switch, and he had to turn it off because his mom made him turn it off, and I was like, don't worry, I'm not going to use the Switch. You can just t put it to sleep. I promise I won't use the Switch, so you can just... He was in the middle of something, probably Stardew Valley or something. And, uh, or maybe it was Mario and Rabbids. I don't know. But, yeah. I promised. I couldn't close the game. <laughs> I couldn't do it, so I had to reschedule. And also, just life has been crazy, been so busy. I mean, the game... This game, this DLC has been out for days, and I want to do a review, so, like... Here I am, way, way uh, later than I wanted to be. Yeah, I'm hearing good things about this this second DLC. It sounds like it's got a lot of cool features. Uh, so I don't know, I, I'm hoping at least for the features it might be cool. At the same time, I'm not really playing this game actively, so like features aren't really gonna do much for me. I need like stuff to do, uh, so I don't know. I'm not sure, yeah, I was not a big fan of the first one, the first DLC, it was just kinda, eh. Yeah, I don't know. But we'll see, though. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know much about it. I keep hearing people say, like, what the features are, but then I just kind of forget. Because like, I'm just, I don't know, like, my brain is not, I'm not letting it solidify. I'm just kind of... So we'll see. Yeah, I really don't know. Oh, a lot of people saying they've only heard bad things about the DLC. Interesting. Mixed. Reception seems to be mixed. But that is the funny thing about Pokemon. It really just depends on your playstyle and what you get out of it. Different features and different things, it's gonna it's gonna be very different for everybody. 
So we'll see. So we'll see. Good turnout today. Good turnout. Hey, everybody. Shirts till it hurts. Thank you so much for the super. Hi, Arlo. My son Jimmy is homesick, but this is the first time we've caught one of your live streams. Thanks for everything you do. Whoa, what's up? Hey, Jimmy. Jimmy. I'm sorry you're sick, Jimmy. It's no fun to be sick. It's a little fun to be home, but not fun to be sick. <laughs> so, that's great. Well, I hope hope you have a good time watching me fumble my way through uh, through this. What's funny is, like, streaming, you kind of just gotta... It's almost like you gotta forget people are watching, because then you think about it too much. So now in the back of my mind, I'm gonna be like, Oh, I can't mess this up for Jimmy. <laughs> I can't embarrass myself in front of Jimmy. I have to imagine that all these people watching, they're not real. They're just... These, uh, these chat messages, they're just auto-generated. It's all AI. No one's watching me. There's so many people saying they're sick, watching, oh no, everyone's sick right now. Uh-oh. That's sad. But it's alright, let's all be sick together. Again, surprised that I'm not, it's crazy. There was even a bug, it went through my house! My little, little nephew, I got two of them, and he... he I was around him a lot, and he was sick. I didn't get it. It's crazy. Usually, like, uh-oh, one person in my life got sick. I'm gonna get it every time. But yeah, I don't know. My, my body's just doing a lot better, I guess. We're all watching and judging. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry you have to go to work soon, uh, Medius. It's gonna snow real bad. Oh man. Yeah, I've never really had to deal with a lot of snow. It doesn't really snow a lot. Here in California. Alrighty. Alrighty. Let's have some fun. Let's play some pocket mans. Some small mansters. Is the performance better for me in this game? It sure wasn't in the first chunk of DLC. No, I'm one of those people who've had just terrible performance overall. And uh, yes, it is installed on my system, not on the SD card. Rotototo. This is Clavel. Do I have the pleasure of speaking? Yeah, this is my phone. That's kind of how phones work now. Only one person can answer it. That's me. My, my, it certainly does this old heart good to be greeted with such a lively response. Unlively, if you say anything about me. Now, if I could take but a moment of your time, there is something we must discuss. I know that literally the last second you just wrapped up this <laughs> DLC on this trip to this land, but uh, I got another thing for you. Blueberry. Oh, it rings a bell. Indeed, tales of your school trip to Kitakami with the Blueberry cohort reached even my office. In any case, the director of Blueberry Academy happens to be an old friend of mine, and he told me that he would be delighted to host you as an exchange student at his school. I really... I, you should give it to someone else. I was one of the lucky few kids in my class. You should really give this opportunity to somebody else. Etc. Thank you for the super. Greetings from Columbia. Wow. That is far away from here. I accept your greetings, and I'm very, very pleased that you are here. Thank you so much. Uh, yes, wake me up inside. I do post my stream VODs. They are all on uh, Arlo Plays, along with my old Let's Plays that I don't do anymore. <laughs> I... I, 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 I always like the idea of returning to them, but I kind of feel like now that I started streaming, I don't know. I'm not sure if that's on the cards anymore, but never say never. Never say never. Also, hello from the Netherlands. That's the crazy thing about this here, uh, internet. Mexico, wow. Another Colombian fan. Is that, uh, you can really just kind of come from anywhere. Fascinating technology. Back in my day. We had to send letters. I mean, we also had the internet, but we also had letters. I believe it would be a fine chance for you to learn even more about the world. 
one should always take advantage of new challenges like this, don't you think? Though I must confess, I was a bit surprised the Blueberries director would specify you by name. Oh, I see what's going on. I'm Mr. Famous. I get all the special opportunities. Unfair. Still, I think it best that you meet the man at least once to find out what he might be thi what he might be thinking. Oh, thanks. Vote of confidence. What's his problem? Sending you on this trip. What's he thinking? Get to the bottom of this. He's admittedly a bit of a character, but not to worry. I'll be there with you when you meet him. Well, now I'm worried. What's he gonna attack me? Once you feel ready to respond to his offer, I ask that you come by my office so we can discuss the specifics together. I love specifics. In particular. Now, I won't take up any of you, more of your time. Do take care until we speak again. In literally 10 seconds. In as long as it takes to fast travel there. Except not really, because I have to relearn the controls. <laughs> like every time. Yep, that's how you do that. I, uh, map. And I've also been playing a lot of PlayStation. So uh, I might get A and B mixed up for a bit. Uh, change map. Go to school. This map is terrible. Oh, see, there it is. I hit the wrong button. I've been playing Horizon Zero Dawn. <laughs> and before that, Demon's Souls. So I, uh, A is, on, is the right button, not the bottom one. I will remember. Metroid Dread is your favorite game? That's a good game. That's a good game. I can't I can't mash through all the text. I gotta at least summarize. I think. I don't know. Maybe <laughs> maybe no one cares. <clears throat> Who do we have here? I know I've seen your face somewhere before. Who are you again? I am Arlo. Oh, that's right, you're Arlo. Yes, yes, I know you. Well then, now that you're here, let's get going, bye! Wait! Hold the phone, stop the presses, Director Cyrano. So glad I didn't have to walk up to his office. Oh, hello there, Veli. You're as lively as always. Didn't realize you were here. Of course I'm here. As director of this academy, where else would I be? And do address me more properly while students are present, would you? They sound like old roommates. More importantly, what are you doing here? I thought we had agreed to meet in my office. Did we? Must have slipped my mind. Anyway, what's it matter? This is the student, right? Well, yes, he is, but... Oh, I do apologize, Master Arlo. You must be terribly confused. This is Director Cyrano of Blueberry Academy. As I mentioned on the phone, he's interested in accepting you as an exchange student. Yep, that's me, Director Cyrano. I, I, did I not mention that? One look at our young friend here makes me suspect you indeed failed to clarify that point. Speaking of which, why did you request Master Arlo specifically particularly to take part in your exchange program. Excellent question, Veli. It's very simple. You see, the reason is he's famous. It's good for business. Uh, hmm. Why did I put in that request? Oh, that's right. The school trip to Kitakami. Shoo! Thank you for the super. You are incredible. I love you. I love you dearly. Hope you enjoy this one. I personally had tons of fun. I literally can't stop playing. That's great. That's great to hear. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, Arlo met some of my students there, didn't he? Yes, yes. One of them was named Carmine, I believe. She's the one who recommended you. The very pleasant one. The, or the unpleasant one who uh, likes to verbally abuse her little brother. Yes, that one. That miserable girl who made the whole experience significantly less enjoyable. Yes, yes. Now that I've gotten to meet you for myself, yeah, I've got a good feeling about you. 
I can tell by the fact that you've said nothing since you got here that we're going to get along just fine. Oh ho, I'm glad to hear that, Director Cyrano. I'd just love for you to visit my school. You would be a breath of fresh air, so to speak. Figuratively, not literally. Well, if anything can be said about Director Cyrano, it's that he has a keen eye for talent. And fashion. And ties. Is that a tie? I would be thrilled if you went to Blueberry Academy and got to know the students there. But only if you're willing to, of course. I mean, you did... You did pay. <laughs> you did pay for this uh, DLC. I assume you'd like to, but you know, whatever you want. Think of it as a chance to further expand upon your treasure hunt. Your figurative treasure hunt. I wish I could accompany Master Arlo, but I'm afraid I must ask you to watch over him in my stead. Parents still M.I.A. You will watch over him, won't you? Hey, M Mattias, Medeus, Mattias, M Mad Aeus. Thank you for the super. Gotta head to work now. Oh, I love you. I love you. Please have a good day at work. Please have a wonderful day. I hope to see you again at another stream very soon. Oh, of course, I'd never let anything happen to one of your students again. I hope this experience leads you to even more you can treasure, figuratively. Best of luck to you. Love that Psyduck. <laughs> Just give me a holler whenever you're ready to head to my Blueberry Academy. Oh, well, you know, uh, let me check my schedule. Yeah, okay, let's go. Holler, gonna holler right in your face. Are you all ready to kick off your studies abroad at Blueberry Academy? I sure am. One field trip to another. Great, then let's get going. The hidden treasure of Area Zero. Part two. The Indigo Disc. This Saturday on WB Kids. Hey, Momoka Mocha. Glad you're here. Glad you're here for the first time. Ta da! We're here! Welcome to my Grand Blueberry Academy. Wow, look at those graphics. <laughs> This is actually just the entrance. The school itself is mostly underwater. Isn't that amazing? Definitely worth the, the money, the feat of engineering that went into it. Millions and millions and do of dollars. Taxpayer money, actually. Oh, and did you notice? Look at how blue the place is. I can't tell you how long I spent picking the perfect blueberry color. I do like, I'm, I'm fond of blueberries, especially in recent years. I really just, I like them a lot. Let's see, what else? Uh, perhaps you have something you'd like to ask me? Wink, wink, hint, hint. I really don't know what he's talking about. Uh, why is this, why is this, why, why water school? Why is that practical? Really? That's what you're curious about? The least interesting thing about this semi-aquatic academy? Well, it's very simple, you see? It's, uh... It's because the school building is attached to an undersea plant that develops natural resources, right? That's what I've heard. I don't have a real voice yet, because I don't know this person. Yes, right, exactly. Took the words right out of my mouth. Okay, I gotta adapt a little bit. Always on point, aren't you, Lacey? Oh no, it was nothing. Do we have a guest today? We do, Arlo here is part of the exchange program. Make him feel welcome, eh? Hold on, this is the exchange student from the Paldea region? I suppose I didn't introduce myself, did I? I'm Lacey, one of the second year students here. You must really be something special, you know. It's rare for Director Cyrano to remember the name of a new student, that's funny. Ha! Huh, just call me out, why don't you? <clears throat> Actually, I've got an idea. Why don't you explain how things work around here, Lacey? I'm going to take a nap. You... you want me to do it? 
Unpaid labor. Efficient. Always delegate tasks. You have to do less work and you seem more important. It's a double whammy. <laughs> oh, please don't take it. It's not that I don't want to show you around. Director Cyrano just has this bad habit of pushing his duties onto me, you see. That's the thing about student workforce. You just call it school. You call it education. And it's just not right. Really letting me have it today, aren't you? We're all kind of pretending like this isn't good fun, but it's actually getting a little tense. This might be my chance to get to know the new student everyone's talking about before anyone else can. Ooh, opportunist. That decides it. I will take on this task. Excellent. Now then, let's head straight down this bridge and to the entrance. On you go. Barbecue? What? Talking about barbecue? That you did? You did a barbecue? Can I see it? Can I have some? Where is it? Where did you do it? We're out in the middle of the ocean. Where is it? Come on. It's the stuff I'm really interested in. Does Magmar contribute to the barbecue? <laughs> Pokemon! <laughs> Just walking around. Your Pokemon following you. Pokemon! That's really That really sums up every person in the Pokemon universe. Their entire world is Pokemon. They no interests apart from Pokemon. You just walk around saying the word Pokemon. <laughs> that's some that's some NPC dialogue right there. This is the entrance to Blueberry Academy. Now is where you start getting a little bit bored of going through all of the stuff and start kind of skipping around. You can battle here. People love battle. Hey, I like battling. I enjoy a Pokemon battle from time to time. Couldn't have said it better myself. Mm-hmm. Relaxing sea breeze, yes. I'm sure. There's one other quality of our school that you'll find likely find very surprising. Wild Pokemon sometimes terrestrialize here. What? Really? Oh, I suppose that's not anything special to someone from Paldea, is it? The terrestrial phenomenon was first discovered in the Paldea region, after all, but we've taken things a step further than you and your Terra Orbs. We've developed some neat tech ourselves, something that lets us control the terrestrial phenomenon on our own turf. I bet that piques your interest, doesn't it? Uh, yes. Let's just say politely that it does. Let's put a pin, let's put a pin in this uh, conversation. Yeah, let's battle. Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Let's see uh, what level her Pokemon are. Right at the... Uh, oh, wait. I missed an important thing. Elite 4? That's okay. I just look over to the stream. Hold on. Member of the Elite 4 League Club? We're going to be seeing that, uh, that hand crossover gesture a lot, aren't we? <laughs> It'd be a good show, you two. In a battle that's definitely been uh, scaled to match the average level of my Pokemon, for sure. For sure. Definitely. It's going to be a good challenge. Because, you know, I've already gone through the entire game and a whole chunk of DLC, and now I'm here. So, I'm expected to have high-level Pokemon by now. Right? Right? Double battle! Whoa, sweet! Oh, I should have introduced my Pokémon. I'll, I'll do that later. I did that on the other stream, but that was on Twitch. 70! Hey! That's good! That's good! 70, not bad. We'll see if they pose any challenge, but... Uh, what capture card do I, I use? I am currently using an Elgato HD60 Pro, but I need to, uh, I got it replaced. I just need to, it's, there's something wrong. It, it seems to be working with streams, but whenever I record with it, it's messed up. Um, I need to install my new one. They sent me a new one. Whoa, Chugga Conroy's here. 
actually surprised how hard some of this stuff was. That's good. That's good to hear. That was not the case with the last one. What's up, Chugga? Good to have you here. Thanks, buddy. Thanks for coming by. See, you're more of a Pokemon expert. I'm not. I'm the casualest player in the entire world, so watch me. Watch me fumble through this. What's a Pokemon? I don't even know. So those those Mises is electric, electrical. So uh, we're definitely gonna flip turn because that's we just get out of here. Uh, oh yeah, use it on. I don't know. And then uh, and then we'll do uh, we'll do some kind of some kind of smack, some kind of earthquake. When does he flip turn? I don't care. Who cares? Just earthquake him. Just do it all. <laughs> Doubles tend to be faster paced and can really get out of hand quickly if they have good strats. That's all right. I I uh, I know I know what I'm doing. I'm great. I'm great at this. I'm real good at this. It's my precious baby. My precious mu my precious mushy. Ah, come on. That was supposed to beat you. Oh, would you look at that? You go right after those type weaknesses with precision, don't you? No one else does that. That's not a thing. It's not a thing people do. <laughs> I don't even remember all my moves and what they do. I don't know. Uh, uh, yeah, Earth Power. There you go. And then, I don't know, just give him some kind of, some kind of smack. Just smack him. Smack him right up. Beat him. Done. Destroyed. Looks like my plus minus strategy was that a squirrel? Sorry, a squirrel just ran by my window up on the fence. <laughs> Exadrill. Uh, I take Exadrill for my allergies. Uh, have I fought an Exadrill? <laughs> Sorry, I'm laughing at my stupid joke. A uh, hammer arm! Why not? Let's shake them to their core. Exadrill used. Histamine! Like, mean. Once daily hex drill. Ask your doctor. The advocate, thank you for the super. Hey Arlo, just wanna say, hope you're well and having a festive Christmas season. Looking forward to your 2024 predictions. I am! It's going by way too fast. So much work to do. It's just like been flying by. I haven't even finished writing the predictions video yet, so I don't know if we can get it done before the end of the year. Uh, we will try though. We will absolutely try. Still got to do that. Still got to do, uh... Uh... Hype video. Next year hype games. Maybe an end of year review. I'm not sure. We'll see. Spectacular! You really are quite skilled. I wish I could have seen you terrestrialize one of your Pokemon, though. I'd l Yeah, honestly, I just forgot. Forgot I could. So... <laughs> Uh, David Lopez, thank you for coming. Thank you for the super. Do you have any thoughts about director Westball wanting to make the Legend of Zelda, the Zelda movie, a live-action Miyazaki? Can you make a video about it? Uh, I will be. I have been meaning to. It'll probably be January, just because I have so much other stuff going on. But I, I'm definitely going to have a whole uh, bigger conversation about 
just that about like can a live action movie work and what are the chances and all that. So yeah, I'll I'll be going into all of that. Thank you for the question. I mean, I think it's I I it's so vague though. I don't to answer that immediate question. I really just like I don't know. I, I it's a good idea. Yeah, I kind of wish they would Miyazaki movie. I I wish I lived in a timeline where that could just be what it was. Well done, both of you. You really battled it out blueberry style. Speaking of style, I forgot I had a uniform for you. Oh, thank you. Do, are you going to force me to change? Ah, uh, I don't want my hair like that anymore. They changed it. Is that left over from the other area where they like made me change it? I don't want it. Indigo style card. Wow. Thank you so much. <laughs> it's, just like, it's like a Christmas gift you don't want. Oh, wow. This is really cool sweater. A world famous terrarium. Wow, thank you. I'm definitely uh, gonna wear this later. I just need to wash it first. Just need to wash it first. Wait, 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 no. Uh, you know, I got very sensitive skin. No, sorry. What's the button? Which is the button? Uh, that one? No! No! <laughs> that one. Profile. Uh, change photo, change... How do I change my clothes? Do I go into... Settings. No, okay, well. Now I'm bored trying to figure this out, so let's just keep going. I'm sure it'll be easy, but I don't wanna. Another from David, thank you, David. Have you seen any movies from Studio Ghibli, uh, like Princess Mononoke, Spirited Away, or the most recent movie, Boy in the Heron? I've not seen Boy in the Heron. I really want to. I've seen uh, lots of their movies. Back in the late 2000s, they were all the rage. Your Spirited Away, Mononoke's great. Totoro's great. Yeah, lots, lots of good ones. Howl's Moving Castle, super good. I actually didn't like Spirited Away as much as most people. I kind of want to watch it again, because that was like a super long time ago. Left on the D-pad to change clothes. Okay, I'll do that in a bit. I need to watch them all again. I don't think I've even watched a Miyazaki movie in quite a long time. Didn't really like Ponyo, but I need to like, yeah. That'd be a really fun one to marathon. This is it, the park beneath the sea that has gained renown around the world. Our very own terrarium. It is really cool. We may be underwater, but the projectors built into the walls and ceiling make it feel like we're actually outside, don't they? We've been able to create a comfortable environment for Pokemon through technology. I designed all this myself, and believe me, it wasn't cheap. Yeah, I can tell. I can tell. Within this dome, there are four distinct biomes. Here we have the nice and toasty subtropical savanna biome. Then off to your right, you can see the breezy tropical coastal biome. Further out to your left, you'll see the craggy, crunchy, rugged canyon biome. Le oh my gosh, stop with the glitching. Last but not least, way out in the distance, we have the arctic and snowy polar biome. <clears throat> Each biome's air temperature and humidity levels are regulated with utmost care. That's why you can find completely different Pokemon species living in each area. We sure put a lot of effort into it. Tell me, Arlo, which biome tickles your fancy off the bat? Hmm. Uh... The coast. Quite tickled by that one. That's my favorite, too. The breezy atmosphere is just so calming. Just love the beach. If you need to heal up your team while you're down here, feel free to use the self-serve healing machines we've installed around the terrarium. 
Now then, Director Cyrano, can you explain to us why crystals form here and, and all that? Well... It's that. It's the terrarium core, which presides over all that happens in the terrarium. Stop saying terrarium. David, you're spoiling me today. <clears throat> Thank you so much. Would you want to see Studio Ghibli handle The Legend of Zelda movie with or without Miyazaki? Uh, I mean, I don't know. I don't know how much they've done exactly without him. I know it's not been a super good track record. Um, if anything, just for the art style, like, I, w I mean, yeah, I would love to see that. Love to see them at least try. With him would be best, but obviously he wants to do his own projects when he's deciding to do projects at all. <laughs> No, that would be incredible. It would be it would be amazing. Dream of a Zelda movie that gorgeous. Uh, it contains a fluid that we have jam-packed full of a special material from Paldea. It's constantly emitting terrestrial energy. That's what allows Pokemon to terrestrialize in the dome. Though I still don't know what that special material is within the terrarium core itself. It's never been shared publicly, has it? Ooh, secret. Secrets? I've plum forgotten. <laughs> Briar put all of it together, so I'm not certain myself. That's what I thought you might say. Bing bong bong bing. We really need to replace that with an actual bing bong bong bing. <laughs> not just a person saying bing bong bong bing. Practical battle class will commence shortly in the coastal biome. Students participating in this class should make their way to the coastal biome now. Bing bong, bing bong. <laughs> oh, looks like you're just in time to see a class session too. This is too good of a chance to pass up. Go to there. Yes, I shall. I will. Teehee. I do love to see that sort of passion for education. I'll go ahead and do a thing on the map, and just, yep, thank you. It's fun, it is, it's cool. I'm done with this conversation. Thank you. Bye, yep, dorm room, I gotcha. Pokedex, mm-hmm. Update the heck out of that, yep. Yeah, yep, see you later. <laughs> go bye-bye, bye. And there he goes. Yes, I'll count on you. Let's go to class. Thank you. Thank you. Very good. Okay. Yep. I see you there. Bye. <laughs> see you in a bit. Wow. These people are a little clingy. Alrighty. You gonna make me remember what I wear? Are you gonna load or do I just have to like do it? I don't remember what I normally wear. Oh. Blueberry. Oh, it's all blue. Okay. Yeah, I've really not like purchased clothing. Purposefully. It's not a thing that I do. Uh, winter. Okay, good. I'm alright with whatever socks you got. Uh, yeah? Uh-huh. What's the Rhyhorn? Oh, he's cute. I don't know what returning Pokemon are gonna be here, so that's cool. Good. Uh, what was I wearing before? Didn't I have like a beanie or something? Or am I thinking of... Am I literally thinking of uh, Sword and Shield? <laughs> Might be thinking of Sword and Shield. Alright, fine. Whatever. Never got a better hat than that. Cool. Alright. Yeah, just, uh, uh, yeah. 
I don't have to change my hair, I'll just wear a hat. That's what I do in real life when I don't brush my hair. Just wear a bunch of hats. A Chansey, back in my day, it's hard to come by you. Now you're just here, first thing. Executes Venomoth Gen 1 strong here. It is strong. Oh, right. I need to, uh, I need to introduce you all. Anyone who, uh, who's not been around, introduce you to my, uh, my special, precious lovelies. Uh, this is them! And I love them all, even though Miraidon is twerking, apparently. <laughs> um... Yeah, this is, uh, this is Chunk. I love him. I always go for the big, uh, the big, just rock, you know? I start a new Pokémon game, I see a little rock. A little rock fella, I'm always gonna go for that. And, uh, oh, Mushy was really, really difficult to evolve. Really difficult. Because I just love, oh my gosh, I love, love how he ran around all over the place. But I, I evolved him, I, I still love him. I still love him. And, uh, oh, oh, you want to talk about love, love at first sight. This is Claude. Hey, Slashy, thank you for the super. Did I see the horror movie parody of me? Uh, no? I don't think so. I'll have to, I'll have to check that out. Yeah, this is Michael. And, uh, oh, it's been a while since I played. I can't even remember all their names. I can't even remember, what did I? What did I name for us? I always thought Ampharos was bigger. Like when I played in Gold and Silver, I loved Ampharos, and I just did not... Did, I just thought it'd be bigger, I don't know why. It's really not that big. No, Claude, though. Claude's, Claude's excellent. So yeah, this is my family. And then, uh... Bax... Fuff! That's it. My fluffy, fluffy fuff. That's the team. I'm just gonna cruise around for a little bit. A double battle? No thanks. I wanna see who's here. Oh boy, lovely, lovely presentation. With Tauros. Love that frame rate. Love the glitching background. The Smeargle. You don't see you don't see Smeargle a, a whole lot. Not a whole lot, do ya? Does not come up much. Got a lot of these random little uh little block things. Okay. Nice mud pit. Like it. Chansey, Scyther, again. Rhyhorn, this is great. This is the, the picture of nostalgia right here. Emerald Masters. Hot tip, you should check out the first story mission in the Terrarium. Before going out and catching Mons, you'll be able to earn points, which you'll need later. Okay. Thank you for the advice. I will follow it. And I will... Level 65. Oh, this is running terribly. Just terribly. No, don't do that thing. I hate the map in this game. It is terrible. Uh, there. That is my destination now. Let us go to it. Sweet. 
Samuel Romans, I'm happy that you are here. I'm glad that you were able to catch this stream. Oh my gosh, we're literally going in slow motion. Cool. This is miserable. This is... Is this worse? The first chunk of DLC was somehow worse than the base game. This might be worse. I might be, uh... I don't know. Might be imagining it, but, uh... Yeah. Hey, another one from Slashy. Should I send the horror movie parody on Twitter? Yeah, yeah, link... Show me it on Twitter. I will, uh, I will definitely check it out later. I'm just kind of run over here? Okay. What is that? What is that? That's not a real Pokemon. That's not real. What are you? What? <laughs> this always happens. This happened last time, too. There's always Pokemon that just... Slip through the cracks and I just don't remember them. I do I've never seen this bird in my life. This is not real. This is a new this is new. Hobgob began. Thank you for the super. You know, for $35 DLC on top of a $60 game, you'd expect the game to have a consistently great frame rate. You would. You would. <laughs> you would think so. But hey, at least it's including new Pokemon. Like, uh, like this one. Trumbeak. Yep, nope, that's new. They're from Sun and Moon. Okay. That's a new one to me. <laughs> I never played Sun and Moon. Never, never seen that. No, no judge. No, Your Honor, I've never seen that Pokemon before in my life. A Snubble, on the other hand. Snubble holds a special place in my heart. One of the first, one of the first new Pokemon ever revealed. Between like Meryl and Snubble and uh, like Donphan or something. No. No, uh, uh, Esper. I knew that. I knew that name. I knew that. Yeah, I just missed out on the 3DS generation completely. I just was not around. It is a cute birdie. I will say. It's a cute bird. It's like a woodpecker. Oh, I'll get there eventually. Oh, Arlo. Whisper, whisper. You didn't have any trouble finding the place? I don't know why I said whisper, whisper before that. Should have just started talking. Alola, everybody. Shall we get started? Looks like we have a new face here with us today. I'm sure you're all enjoying the tropical climb we've recreated here at the coastal biome. But remember, it's really for the many Pokemon you'll find living here adapted for such weather. It's not for you. You enjoying it is a byproduct. It was not made for you. One such species has grown exceptionally larger than it might in other regions, thanks to all the light it's exposed to here. <gasps> a regional variant? Not even to one region, but like a DLC in a region? Certain species of Pokemon can have completely different appearances depending on the region. This is what we call a regional form. Oh, yeah. Animated Gamer, thank you for being here. Thank you for the super. Trumbeak evolves into a toucan, which is Peak Bird. Yes, I've seen that one. Because it's really like just a toucan, right? <laughs> That's like it. <clears throat> and that brings us to today's task. I'd like each of you to catch one of these Pokemon. Specifically an Alolan form Pokemon. Oh, so it's an Alolan one. Oh, right. So we get the different regions. Is it like... Never mind. I, whatever. When you've got one, come report to me. Now get catching. You didn't tell me what it was. <clears throat> Off you go. Off you pop. Marty Day. Marty Day. 
thank you for coming. Thank you for being here. Considering everything going on in the gaming space, I really appreciate you and your content as a beacon of positivity and drama-free fun. I try. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. I'm glad you're here. We're having fun. Even though I don't know what kind of Pokemon it's but Like any Alolan form? No, I don't know. I suppose the best known Alolan form might be Alolan Executor with its long, long... Yeah, oh yeah. I can find that. I can find that. Easy. What is that? Oh yeah. Okay. I will find that. That's the thing I will catch. Alolan Executor. I see actual palm trees. Gotta be around here somewhere. Let's go traipsing through the laggy grass. <laughs> yeah, kind of. I kind of thought they'd be like on the beach or something, because that's where you find trees. <clears throat> Just not picking up items, because there are too many items, and I don't use the money! Yep, that's, uh... That's it. Let's, uh... Uh... Fight it. Let's, uh... I want to not defeat it. So, uh... Yeah, this is good. Thanks for playing this so we don't have to. You are welcome, Dark Soul Music. Okay, uh, uh, Aqua Tail? I can't even see his head. Because of the stupid camera. I hate this. <laughs> Come on. Entirely too tall. Uh, uh, Hydro Pump. There! Wait, hold on. Why did the other one do so much more? Is it because this is a physical attack? Don't leech seed, I'm already... Ugh. Oh man, come on. No! <laughs> Drain punch this guy. There you go. Come on. Oh, I forget how agonizing this game is to play. It's so slow. Oh, come on. You are... You're annoying. That's what you are. Do I just, like... Yeah, let's terastalize and drain punch this guy. Sure, it won't even do anything. Hop go again! Another one! By the way, this executor is grass and dragon. Ah. As you will see, type matchups, not something that I always remember. I'm I'm rusty. Very rusty. Use Mega Drain. You are bad. You are bad. Okay. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna defeat I don't even care if I don't catch it. I'm switching to something else and I am destroying this thing for annoying me so much. Thoughts on Demich? Is that a Pokemon? I don't know. That's not real. You made that up. <laughs> it's a dragon, huh? <laughs> it's a dragon, huh? I'm gonna knock it out. I shouldn't knock it out. I'm gonna knock it out. I'm gonna hit it. Is 
ice good against dragon? Would that be double good? Uh, yeah, sure. Dragon Claw. It's gonna destroy it. It's gonna destroy it! It destroyed it. It destroyed it. There you go. I don't think I do have any status condition moves, honestly. Okay, let's do better. That was a warm-up. Let's be better. Who's here? Oh, still looking around, still getting my bearings. No! You are bad, snake. Oh, this is miserable. This is miserable. I'm trying not to complain too much, but it's just the performance. It's just, it's, oh. The worse the performance is, the harder it is to accept the uh, slow combat. It, the whole thing just becomes so sluggish. Okay, I shouldn't have knocked it. I didn't know it was going to be this hard to find one. Come on. Uh, is that? Uh, that's not in a lowland form, though, right? It's only the uh, only the executor. Oh yeah, the mucks and the grimers are also. I forgot. Oh, never mind. There's one right here. Uh, I don't know. Uh, no. Uh, uh yeah. Yeah. Uh, super effective, I guess, is not what I want. Okay, well, this puts me in an awkward position. Let's just poison it. <laughs> Which will, uh, inevitably knock it out. I don't know if I have any, uh, quick balls. I don't know, maybe. It's all right, this'll work. This'll do great, I'm gonna do great. Okay. See, that's super effective. I am getting dis <laughs> Getting distracted reading chat. Hey look, a Grimer, an Alolan Grimer. Hello. You been eating mustard? Uh, yeah, let's see, let's see what I got. Let's see what I got. Yeah, here we go. This is gonna work, even at level 62. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. There you go, there you go. There you go! Just, just throw, just start throwing balls. Just start throwing Pokeballs, what you do, mm-hmm. Good job, me. Excellent. You all uh, continue with your nap. Your friend has been permanently enslaved. Oh, good. I can fly. Very good. Heal my poker mans, please. Thank you. Uh, where's it over here? I did the thing. I ran the errand. Yes.
Uh, I was so motivated. It was incredible. You should have seen me. I did really well. So battling isn't your only talent, then. You've got a knack for catching Pokémon, too. If you mean I have the ability to catch Pokémon, the basic knowledge, then yes, I suppose I have a knack for it. Gather around, everyone. We're all out of time for today, so that'll have to be it for this class session. Uh, no, I haven't figured out my moving troubles. Unfortunately, I, uh, the sale of the house fell through and everything crashed and burned and lost the house we were going to buy. And it's all back to square one. So, no. <laughs> kind of just having Christmas time now. Not thinking about moving for a while. It's all right, though. It'll work out someday. Someday. Ugh. <sighs> Guess I'm stuck with homework. Uh, it was fun. Yeah, loved it. Blueberry quests. That's the kind of quest I want to go on. Oh, that's what he meant by barbecue? Oh, man. <laughs> That stinks. I was hoping there was a barbecue. I have never been more disappointed. The sort of like missions that the school assigns to students out and about in the terrarium. You might be asked to have your Pokemon do some auto battles or to catch specific Pokemon, those sorts of things. You also, you have family in Redding too who's been trying to sell their house for like four years. Oof, that's rough. That is rough. No one wants to live in Redding. <laughs> Stinks here. Uh, you never know what the next barbecue might be. Stop saying BBQ. Stop it. I already get hungry every stream. I just start thinking about food. Uh, cool. Yeah. Okay. Special quest. Gotcha. That's cool. Uh, okay. Just right there on the button? Okay. Oh, it's no problem that you have to dash. Get out of here. I would want to get the heck out of Redding, too. My parents sold their house in Humboldt recently, though, and now we're in Washington. See, that's where I'm trying to go. I'm trying to get out of here and go to Washington, although I considered going to Humboldt because I would... I want to live near a city because I want the opportunities, but, like, trust me, I wanted to live in Humboldt. On the beach. Oh, incredible. Row, tow, 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 tow. Oh, man. Who gave her my number? Yeah, hey, Carmine. Uh, no, actually, I didn't. Man. Yay, glad to hear that you're here. Yay. Hope your brother's here. Hope you scream at him. It's really uncomfortable. Catch one Pokemon. Defeat ten while... Okay. Take a photo of a Pokemon that's swimming. Okay. Well, I did catch a Pokemon. I guess I missed that. Let's, uh... Let's auto battle. What's the button again? Go! Go, Claude! Get him! Get him! Defeat him! Destroy those cute birds! I am, uh... 
Gonna get bored of this real fast. I just want to clear like one. Just to kind of see, I guess. How is everyone leveling up? Uh, did I do it yet? Yeah, okay. Travel over 500 yards. I feel like that's gonna be... Pretty simple. Oh, wait, never mind. <laughs> Not with a frame rate like this. It's gonna take a while. I really couldn't run away from this woodpecker. Why, though? Why? Come on. You get more points if you do barbecues with other players? Well, if I can ever get away from this battle, I refuse to fight it. I refuse. Thank you. Thanks. Okay. Can I fly here? You... You mean... I just came from there. Alright. Let's go through this tunnel. Got some, uh, diglets. A lowland diglets. It did not lead through, so... That's, uh, Camel... Camelman? Please climb. Thank you. That's, uh, Spidorb. That's Turt... Turt Fluff. I know all the Pokémon. Did it only just now register that I beat 10 Pokemon? Really? Whoops. Another bird I won't be able to escape from. Ugh. Well, this has been a great battle. This has been, this has been gr oh. <sighs> oh, that was the 500 yards? Yeah, okay. Thank you. Thanks. Whoops. Uh, I've never known if it was like a speed thing or what I've I, I it's the sort of thing you could always just look up just like what makes it so you can't get away I thought it was purely based on level but I don't know if it's like based on speed or what man if the graphics were better this would look really cool how you got like those like steps all that stuff like built into the mountains it's super cool It's really neato. It could be really neato. I I, I get what they were going for. <laughs> oh, hey. Hey, what's up? How are you? Who's your friend? So yeah, things are a bit rough right now. I couldn't agree more. Ah, uh, you have a visitor, Carmine. 
Long time no see, Arlo. Bet you missed me. Yeah, I did. No, I didn't. I didn't miss you. I kind of think you're awful. You're really mean. Did your wonderful memories of me all wither away since we last saw each other? Time for me to go. Nice seeing you, Carmine. So long. Don't leave. Don't leave us alone. You have to be better than her. I don't like people who are mean. That's it. I just don't like people who are mean to people. That's one of my classmates. She's an interesting one. Hmm. Speaking of classmates, it feels kind of weird seeing you here at my school. And look at you. You haven't changed at all since we last met. As for me, well, I've been helping Miss Briar with her research. We've been to all sorts of different regions. It's made my Pokemon a lot stronger than they were. Oh, okay. Yep. I see where this is heading. So I'm just gonna, yep. I am so ready for a double battle. You wouldn't believe. No, they didn't fix the game. It's still busted. It's worse, actually. <laughs> Two cannon dog. Got him. Gonna get him. I'll give you a special treat since you came all this way. Get ready to eat terrarium dirt. That's dangerous. A lot of bacteria in there. All right. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna thunder uh, a bird. And we're gonna stone edge. Let's, I mean, it would be more effective on the two cannon. I don't know, let's throw it at the munchie again. Who cares? Ha! Sorry, bird. Yes, I know, you love to point out when I use super effective moves. Ah yes, Scrafty, the Pants Lizard Pokémon. Oh, Dazzling Gleam works on both, I didn't realize. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. I guess that didn't make sense. Because he's already low. Oh well! Cage Heart! Or Kaje, or Kahe, I don't know. Cage Heart! Person Heart! Thank you for being here. Thank you for the super. Always been a huge fan. GG, my good friend. Well, you're my good friend. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for stopping by. We're just about to destroy a little cup. <laughs> Let's destroy this little cup. With a dazzling gleam. With a dragon pulse. And uh, a slam that is heavy. Oh, I forgot about terastalizing. Yeah, I'm glad that, uh... Yeah, I'm really glad the levels started higher in this. Because it means that after a couple battles, uh, maybe it'll even start getting a little... A little, uh... Challenging. I don't know. Maybe. Matcha gotcha. That was quite the hit. Gotta give it, gotta hand it to him. Uh oh. Uh oh. What makes you so special? <laughs> what makes you so special here? Not taking any damage.
Did it say when it terrestrial? Oh, it's grass type. Of course it is. I should have like thought about that and like tried to, you know, change my strategy based on that. But you know, I think I have to like suffer some losses before I start to like really try. <laughs> you know, really try to. Because most of the time we're just mashing A. I got it right, it is Cage. It was named after the radio station. Wow, okay. That's cool. I, I've not heard of that radio station, but... Wherever inspiration comes from, that did not go the way I had planned. They got so much stronger once I could terrestrialize my Pokemon, but you just had to go and get even stronger, didn't you? No, I'm equally as strong as I was last time, actually. I don't know if that's uh, demotivating for you at all. <laughs> hey, by the way, have you uh, run into Kiki yet? No, uh, you abused him so much that he ran away and we haven't seen him. And I think he probably turned into a villain based on the cutscene at the end of the last one. So I hope you're happy about that. Wait, that's other characters to introduce. Oh. I'm so glad he changed his hair. Can't stand the hair in front of the face thing. It's very aggravating. I thought I told you to train five Pokemon to battle with. I'm mean now. That's my thing. I was kind of timid before, and now I'm mean. Sorry, things have been really hectic at home this month. Oh, got it. So that means you're just okay being this week forever. That, that one I'm hearing? No, I... Well, since you're so busy, I'll go ahead and do you a favor. I'll write your resignation from the club for you. Super mean now. That's my thing. I mean, I'm sorry if you don't like it. Except I'm not sorry because mean people aren't sorry. I don't need people in my club who don't take it seriously. Wait, Karen, I'm sorry. Give me another chance. Oh. <laughs> Not what you were expecting, right? Character developed. Arc uh, progressing. Hasn't been the same since we got back from the school trip. You know, that time when I screamed at him a bunch. Told him how bad he was. Well, that was painful to watch. Irk! Is this your friend, Irk? Hey, Irk. I'm Arlo. If it isn't Carmine and Carmine's new mystery friend. Think I might have heard of you, though. Are you that new kid with the wild backstory? I guess so. What a lovely surprise. Just the annoying bozo I didn't want to run into. Mean. Come on now, at least introduce me. This is Drayton. Oh, last name must be Irk. And he's the worst. <laughs> he's the worst. He's the strongest trainer at Blueberry Academy. Well, he was at least. Beautiful intro, thanks. This is Arlo. He's here on a foreign exchange program. He's my friend, well... What about Kieran? You friends with the guy? Uh, yeah, I guess so. It's gonna get me in trouble. Oh, ho, ho, I see. That's great. All right, Arlo. How about I show you our club room? Huh? Why do you need to do that? You haven't joined any of the clubs. Take it from me. Gotta have a club. We call dibs. Yeah, don't, don't save a spot for me, okay? I'm a little persnickety. I'm not gonna just fall in with whatever crowd seems the coolest. I'm a bit of a wild horse. I don't know if you know this about me, but I am. I'm a wild horse and as a result of that, you cannot tame me. 
that's just something that you all need to know, all you viewers. I'm a wild horse. So, like, there you go. Yeah, exactly. I didn't join the clubs because I just got here. Give me a second. And here we are. This is uh, Hufflepuff. Are you sure this is a good idea? You know, because... Because of Kieran? Nah, don't worry. He won't show up here anytime soon. If you say so. Anyway, this is the base of operations for the League Club. Ooh. That must be the fancy one. The League Club. On behalf of the whole club, glad you're here. What's this League Club you speak of? Hehe, <laughs> glad you asked. We Blueberry Academy students have our own Pokemon battle ranking system. The BB League. The Barbecue League. Here in the League Club, we battle each other to train up so we can climb the ranks. We win, we lose, we have a good old rowdy time. Such is our humble club in a nutshell. You're not wrong, but seriously, that's how you explain it to new people. Yep, though I guess we're having less of a good old rowdy time than usual lately. I'm a member of the club too. I don't show up to the club room very much though. Just FYI, the top four Pokemon trainers in the BB League are called the BB League Elite Fear. And this annoying toothpaste haired bozo, yikes, is one of them. So is that girl you saw me with at the terrarium earlier. Too bad you didn't make the cut, Carmine. Ooh, oh, right where it hurts. This is why she is the way she is. Hurt people hurt people. I've just been too busy with extracurricular stuff. I haven't had time for league matches. Irk. If we're talking actual skill, I'm way above any of the Elite Four. Oh yeah, I'm sure. That's no lie. What you think, Arlo? Fun club, huh? Yeah, I'm having a great... A great time. I'm not having a great time. <laughs> just gonna be honest. I wanna be honest. I just, I wanna be more honest in the coming year, you know? I have a feeling you're more into the idea than you're letting on. Good socially lubricating out. Anyway, think that takes care of it. You're in on a trial basis. I did not apply. Not even verbally. I told you it does not sound good. Huh? What do you mean, trial basis? You heard me. Far as the Dracer's concerned, that's what I want you to call me. We're clubmates now. Trial basis clubmates. So now you can use this club room freely and do whatever with the stuff here. Can I throw it? Can I write in the books? Can I peel off the wood paneling? <laughs> Can I play Minecraft on that computer? Using the PC in the League Club room, you can help support the efforts of other clubs by donating. This is a lot bigger of an expansion. This seems to be really setting the foundation for a lot more. The other one was like a brief story and a little area. This is like, there's like its own Elite Four. There's different clubs. There's these missions. This is more of a thing. I like. I mean, I basically played through the entirety of the previous DLC in one stream. It does not look like it's gonna happen here. <clears throat> Can I paint over the blue with the color of my choice? Yeah. <laughs> um, reap all kinds of rewards. Cool. Here, give it a shot and you'll see what I mean. Can I push that Pikachu off the couch? Can I hang non-backpack things on those backpack hooks? <laughs> Try sending that to Mitch in the baseball club. He can help you out with your throwing form. Baseball club, what is... I'm here on a field trip. I'm not, this is not my school. Can I draw silly things and erase all of these things? Can I put garbage in the recycling and the recycling on Carmine? 
Can I tear this down and stomp on it? Can I stuff these lockers with various cheeses? Can I bring cats to run on these treadmills? Can I eat all of this food? Can I throw all of this food into a big pile and then just pour water on it and... I'm gonna stop the joke now. <laughs> My Tyrogue loves this treadmill. Boy, I can see that. I can see that. He's going... He's going crazy. I mean, you know, they didn't animate this to work, but I can tell by the way he's floating off the ground. He loves it. Just loves it. <laughs> no, 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 no. You, you misunderstand. He doesn't... He doesn't love using it. He just loves it. Just loves looking at it, touching it, thinking about it. <laughs> All right, what am I doing? What's the actual story thing I'm doing? Use the computer. Oh, okay, okay. And then Minecraft. Uh, contribute BP. Pitch. Some cool throwing styles. I'm developing new throwing style. Oh yeah, yeah, that's how you get your new uh, your new throws. Okay. Smug style and elegant style. Uh yeah. Roto -to -to. Thanks for the support, Arlo. Wish we could do it in person, but let's try pitching some ideas for new ways to throw. See, I was thinking I could hold my hand like this. Like what? Just to, okay, I don't even have to visit you. Just kind of, okay. Uh, sure. How do you change them? Oh, whoa, you did it. Not bad for your first time. That'll teach me to doubt your skills. You doubted my skills? Come on. Here, I've got a really nice present for you. I'm one charming catch, to, from one charming catch to another. Catching charm. Having one of these mysterious, unshakable charms, you can't shake it. it, just hangs like a dead weight, makes it more likely you'll get a critical catch. Okay. Just makes catching easier, like, overall. I just get that. I don't even have to, like, earn it. Please don't make me change. <laughs> Please don't make me change into it. Uh, okay. Okay. And that's not all. For a limited time, you can have as many of these snacks. See, that's where I wanted to get to. Yeah. Yeah. Those snacks are all yours, Drayton. And snacks you leave around opened and half finished. I can deal with that. I'm a big snack finisher, okay? I have no shame about it. I'm a big food finisher. I have... <laughs> I mean, I'm not super proud of it, but I have gone to restaurants with groups of friends and ordered nothing and left very satisfied especially red robin unlimited fries i wouldn't go near any of them who knows how long they've been sitting around all that explaining left me starving i think i'm gonna head on over to the cafeteria if you want to officially join us maybe we can have a cafeteria date to talk details a what be seeing ya. He's so cool. Ah, that bozo. Seriously, what's his problem? And a cafeteria date? What does he even mean by that? Well, uh, well a date. Uh, <laughs> the, way, the way she looked at me. No, I know what a date is. Were you seriously about to explain it to me? Uh, sorry, being in here puts me on edge. Let's go somewhere else. Some place people will bother us. I know. Let's go to your room. I have a room? Don't go to my room. I don't know. Are you going to warp me there? Can I warp there? Yeah, I can. <laughs> no. Oh. There's a fly thing on it. I should be able to warp there. Navigating indoors is not a thing you normally have to do in this game. Oh, right. That's okay. Yeah, great. Uh-huh.
Well, it looks like this is your room. Is that the exact same layout as my room in the other academy? Uh, it's really about the same, honestly. I'm cool. I get the feeling that your room probably looks a lot like this room. It's about Drayton and, well, Kiki. You saw how he is. He's scaring me nowadays. Ever since we got back from Kitakami, it's like he's become a totally different person. He's been battling and training every day. He's even cutting back on sleep. He's definitely gotten stronger. Drayton used to be the strongest student here, but Kiki beat him. Now Kiki's the president of the league club and the BB club league champion. I guess he must be pretty busy. He barely talks to me anymore. I wonder why. Oh, well, he's probably just going through a rebellious phase. Kieran's changed, but you, you have stayed the same. If Kieran's down to just one friend these days, I'm glad it's you. Keep sticking with him, would you? Uh... No. <laughs> just walks right up to her, staring her in the eyes, and just, uh-uh, not gonna be his friend. Can't you read the room? You're supposed to say yes. There's one more thing. I've sudden shift. One more thing I need to tell you about. Oh, Drayton. Don't trust that knucklehead. That chowder brain, that noodle noggin. Sorry for swearing. He might seem like a slacker, but don't let him fool you. He's up to something. He's a real annoying super jerk. He barely even goes to class. He's had to repeat the same year three times. That's embarrassing. I mean, you gotta, gotta at least go to class. Point is, don't let your guard down with him ever. Kevin Vu! Thank you for the super. Would you play the Wario Land games? Especially two through four. I would! I, I wish there was like one good place to just like play them all. Uh, but I've heard they're great. I definitely want to play them someday. You're going on your date. I mean, you're, you're gonna go hang out with Drayton later, right? I'll go with, but if I don't finish up this report today, I'm really gonna be in trouble. I'd love for you to join the league club, but if Drayton gives you any trouble, okay, I'm a little done with this. Give him a sucker punch. I'm not gonna punch anybody. I'm not you, okay? Don't hurt people. That's the closet. Where am I going? Is that the bathroom? Uh, Cafetria, please. Welcome, just let, let me know what you'd like and I'll dish something right up for you. What, free food? Really? Oh, no. Uh, sorry, I'm going low carb and uh, none of this is doing it for me. I, I'll bring, I'll get my own. Hey, Arlo, no need to stand there, grab a seat. Here's the Drayster take. The Academy Special is the best thing on the menu. It's all so soft, you can basically just gulp it down. Barely even need to chew. That's gross. Please. <laughs> chew your food, Drayton. <laughs> you and my ma would get along. It's almost as though I'm actually a 30-something adult talking to a teenager. I probably would get along with your mom more than you. So listen, your Pokemon are pretty strong, yeah? With a team like that, you've got a shot at becoming the BB League champion. Wouldn't that be wild? An exchange student just rolling up here and snatching the crown? That would be wild. I would say, crazier things have probably happened. I want to see you join the BB Lo League, Arlo. You in? Uh, I don't know. Look who's decided to grace us with their pre- I've never had to select a dialogue option in a game that was pre-interrupted. <laughs> You know, like before I even selected it. I could tell I was going to be interrupted. Yog, thank you for the super. Arlo, distrust all toothpaste haired bozos. 
then I definitely won't be playing ARMS anytime soon. But dum chow That's a bunch of cool kids. Whoa, it's the champion. Sharp Edge, what's up, buddy? I'm dreading that the black and white remake will be like BDSP. If that happens, will you just review the originals instead? It's a new game either way. No, I'll, I'll review. If they remake black and white, I'll play the remake. Um, yeah, I liked black and white a lot more than uh, Diamond and Pearl initially. I am afraid that the remake is going to be the same, though. I really don't want it to be just a... Just a really disappointing but at least if the game is better it'll just be more enjoyable i just don't like diamond and pearl that much apparently platinum was good but i didn't remake that so and the rest of the elite four too what did you want to talk to me about uh nothing special just thought we could grab a bite where better to do that than the cafeteria what a waste of time. Mean now, just as a reminder. If you've got so much time to goof off, why don't you go train your Pokemon? You think maybe this is why you always lose to me? I'll take that as a no. So I can't swing a lunch date with you, even if you got your old pal with me. I've got your old pal with me. How's it what? Arlo? Uh, long time no see. Why? You didn't hear that he was coming to study abroad? There's a lot of story. I'm kind of, I'd kind of like to get to a battle or some exploring. Uh, for real? Yes, it's true. Director Cyrano himself introduced him to me when we met at the school's entrance. We're already tight, us two, just so you know. We're pretty much best friends. In fact, I was just asking Arlo to join the BB League. New character with frying pan. Oh, I like it. That'd be fire. What? A student from another school joining the BB League. Unprecedented. That's right. Mud Rocks. Hello. Thank you. Thank you for coming. Thank you for the super. Play Pizza Tower. I've heard it's good. I've definitely heard it's good. But I've not played it. Maybe someday. Uh, MK Best, thank you as well. I'm so pleased that you are here. I hope you're feeding Roberta the high horse well. Oh, always. She's always grazing out in the pasture. That definitely exists outside of my house. I give her crunchy carrots every day. And tell her my... My, uh, lofty, self-important opinions. <laughs> Arlo may be wonderfully capable in battle, but that doesn't mean he belongs in the BB League... Oh, come on. Y'all hate... Y'all hate fun and friendship or something. You want to exclude someone who's taking our same class and living in our same dorms? Thank you. Thank you, Drayton. Sticking up for me. How is he not one of us? I ask of you. And isn't this place supposed to be all about students having autonomy? Stands up on the table. Kicks over the water. I think we should vote on it. I'm a yes, obviously. How about you, Lacey? Uh, I'm sorry, but considering the rules, it's a no for me. Oh, Lacey. Lacey, come on. Thought we connected. What about you, Crispin? Huh? Yeah, why not? I like you, Crispin. You look like you cook, and you want me in the club. I like you. He's at our school. Makes him a student like us, right? How about you, Amorous? What do you say? I abide by the rules of this institution. Proposition declined. Oh, come on. Two against two, huh? All right, then. What says the reigning BB League champion, our mighty Kirin? It doesn't matter who I'm facing. I don't lose. <laughs> ah, I guess we got our answer. Do we? I didn't. Was that a yes or a no? Drayton, manipulating people to get what you want, it's just not right. <laughs> I like I like how he walked off. Sorry, Arlo. Guess you'll be joining the BB League, huh? I I guess. I guess so. 
Well, let's look on the on the bright side. Maybe you and Kieran will come out of this better friends. Don't worry, I'll be right behind you every step of the way. But now the decision's been made, we better get you officially signed up. Meet me at the reception desk and the, well, if it's against the rules though, you're literally students. I don't, I don't think this is gonna work. Okay, I will join the BB League. This was the hard part of the previous DLC, it was just all the setup. It's not terrible. It's not like, I mean like, characters and story so far, like it's okay. It's not bad. I think I'm just, I'm getting the, I'm getting the stream jitters. You know, I want to like do stuff. I'm feeling kind of, I want to get to some doing. How can I help you today? I want, I get, apparently, I want to join the BB League. Even though there are no BBQs as we have established. Ah, it says here that you're an exchange student, which means you're not technically enrolled here, so it's not going to work until the director comes by and tells me to make an exception. Oh, don't mind that. We we all talked it over. He's good. I don't mean to sound rude, but I'm not sure if I can take what you say at face value, Drayton. Oh, not the director, but other students. Yes, they have the authority needed here. Certainly. I'm allowing Arlo to join the BB League. Me, a student. I make the rules. Oh, yes, champion. Sorry, champion. One moment, please. Somebody get champion a drink. Didn't expect you to ride up in shining armor and save the day. I got a feeling you're trying to play puppet master. But if I get a shot at battling Arlo, then that's fine. Can we? Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's battle. Is that a thing you want to do? Is it? I can do that right now. I'm ready. I have my Pokemon. Let's do it. Until our battle, we could do it now. Like I'd lose. Good, that's disturbing. Disturbing. I'm not a little kid anymore since you saw me about an hour and a half ago <laughs> in another part of the world. You'll know it when I show you how the best of the best battle. Kiki, you shouldn't talk to Arlo like that. Take out studios. Thank you for coming. Thank you for the super. I just gotta say, Arlo, I love your content. I've been a fan since 2016. Another one of the, one of the, another one of the old guard. Keep up the good work. Much love from Minnesota. Thank you so much. I'm really glad you're here. Very glad you're here. Thank you so much for the support, for sticking with me for so long. Shut it, sis. <gasps> he said something rude. He said a rude thing. It's like... <laughs> I've read a lot of books to my little nephews and there's this Berenstain Bears where they... They're just like mean. They're just like rude to each other and they get in a fight. Yeah, that's it. The brother and sister bear get in a fight. And there's like one part where like sister bear is like, you shut up. And it's like, oh, like, you know, it's supposed to be like this big, like gasp. She said such a rude thing. It's funny. Reminds me of that. Cosmic gardening. Also, thank you for being here and for supporting me and giving me a, a love, a lovely super. Funds toward that review you've been meaning to do. Which review? That one, you know? <laughs> I got a couple. I got a couple of those that I've been meaning to do. It's all right, though. New Year's coming. Just got to get through this holiday rush, and then I got all sorts of plans for all sorts of reviews. Got something real nice planned for the Mario Wonder review. And the Zelda and the Pikmin. It'll happen. Eventually. No, but thank you for coming. Cosmic Gardening, love the name. You shut up, Gasp. Looking forward to seeing you climb the ranks. Looking forward to seeing you finish your character arc. I'm sorry, Arlo. Kiki was really uh, acting out, wasn't he? I wouldn't know anything about that. That was my first time talking to him in a while, too. Man, such an attitude. Eh, eh. Kinda of doesn't feel good when people are mean to you. I'm starting to, starting to realize 
Well, he's Mr. Big Deal Mighty Champion after all. Drayton, you are the one who dragged Arlo into all this BB League drama, aren't you? No, it's all his idea. It, it was not. It's it, uh, incorrect. <laughs> right, Arlo? No, it was not my idea. No doubt about it. Hear that, Carmine? He's hungry for action. I don't know. I think something fishy's going on. But well, if you're going to do this, you might as well do your best. I'll be cheering for you. And please keep an eye on Kiki for me. Stupid was a bad word when we were kids, and my little cousin never let us get away with it. It's really funny how, like, different people, different parents... I mean, obviously, like, the more obvious example of, like, parents not allowing words is, like, you know, more uh, highly religious people. You know, like, I, I, growing up, I couldn't say a lot of words. Most of them. Even regular words. I had to speak using pantomime. Uh, no, but, uh... But, like, there, is, there are some people who were just, like, ooked out by, like, relatively benign words. I had a friend whose mom would not let her say nasty. Like, she thought the word nasty was just, like, too evocative, I guess. It's just, like, that's not a, it's not a bad word. It's really funny. Yeah, stupid is just, like, very... Like, you know, it can be rude if you call someone stupid, but, like, yeah. Uh, usually you'd start by battling regular students and climbing the ranks, but you're not regular. You're special. You get everything you want. Start at a higher rank. You'll skip straight to challenging the Elite Four. Well, okay, I guess I am the league champion. I suppose that that's fair. I'll give you that. At their respective bases in the terrarium. They have bases? Let me get this straight. At your school, you live in a giant futuristic terrarium out in the middle of the ocean under the water this magical place you all get to be in clubs you can break the rules and 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 just do whatever you want and your club leaders get to live in bases that's not that does not reflect my high school experience not even almost colin colin Thank you for coming. I love you. Hey, Arlo. Loved Pikmin, Pikmin BFR. When's the next one? I don't know because BFRs are very, 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 very large projects. They're extremely difficult to do. Uh, however, I don't believe you have seen the end of BFRs. I will simply say that. Thank you for coming. Guelph T, thank you as well. Thank you so much. Gasp, how dare you say nasty? I know. I'm sorry. I know this is a family-friendly stream. What can I say? If you were around earlier when I was explaining, uh, I'm a wild horse and you can't tame me. So there you go. Once I clear the trials... Seriously though, Guelph, thank you so much for coming. You're amazing. You're super. You're great. Uh, I'll go ahead and mark their locations. Thank you. Now we're getting to the, the real, they're all meat and potatoes of this. The locations of each of them are on the map. To challenge the Elite Four, you need BP, which you can earn by doing barbecues. Then if you defeat all the members of Elite Four, you can challenge champion. Okay, so I need BP. Now I need to actually get BP. Anytime you want to battle one of us, you'll have to do a fun little trial we cooked up first. Sounds good, right? Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> no, that's cool. Let's, uh, let's do it. Let's earn some, uh, how much BP do you need to challenge someone? I do not know, but I guess we'll just, uh, head into that terrarium and run around dorm room let's terrarium it up maxis animates thank you can't say i ever took you for a naysayer 
Is that a horse joke? We doing horse jokes? I like that. I'll, I'll take that. Oh yeah, I was, I'm a wild horse. Exactly. No, I get it now. I get it now. I'm not... I'm not, not the sharpest taco on the Christmas tree. You gotta give me a minute when you make a pun. Naysayer. That's good. That's good. Um, okay. So yeah, so now I get BP. So that's why... That's why y'all were saying to uh, go do that story thing first. Uh, 50 BP a challenge. Oh, so like, I already... Basically have enough. Floatstone? What's a floatstone? Play some Tetris. Um, go! A defeat. What was that little thing that appeared above it? It was like a little arrow? Was it like a little indicator thing? Yeah, when does... Is that always been there? That's new. Oh, that's not gonna go well. Is that just a thing in the update? That little, like, arrow? Chancy. It's not new. Did I just not notice it before? Huh. Okay. Cool. <laughs> That's just me, I guess. That's just me. Beat it. Defeat it. All right. Um pick up items That won't take too long No Make yourself a TM. I guess I should just go uh, challenge a uh, leader. Oh, nest? How's a bird in there? There's a diaper bird. All right, uh, here, let's go. Oh, I like him though. I don't know if I want to beat him first. Let's go in a reverse order of how much I like them. Uh, you know, he's not bad. He's like, the he's the cool, aloof one, but uh, I don't know. Let's get Lacey out of the way. Uh, oh. Even the map is laggy. Let's see what's over yonder. I really do like Rhyhorn. I was never like a huge fan, but like, I don't know. There's the nostalgia factor, but like, I just really like the design. I just like cool little compact, rocky, groundy, scaly guys. I don't know what it is. I just think he's neat. Just think they're neat. Stop. Play Wind Waker again? But I already played Wind Waker. Did a Let's Play and everything. Back when I was a Let's Player. Is that a... Is it a shiny? 
Or did they just naturally come in different colors? Anyone? Is, this a, is that a thing? I mean, not that I want a shiny Alolan Executor. Shiny? Yeah? Huh. Okay. Uh... Okay. Sure. We'll go for the quick catch again. Wow, shiny. And I could see it because it was humongous and standing exactly next to its friends, which is the only way that I can tell something is actually shiny. Here we go. This is gonna be good. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it with this quick ball. Real quick. Quick catch. Critical catch. I got the charm now. Yeah? Yeah? We got a shiny. On stream? Whoa. I'm a real Poketuber now. I'm a real Poketuber now. Can I get a... Can I get a... A mission for catching a shiny or something? Oh yeah, I guess I should have saved. I didn't really care that much is the, <laughs> is the thing. Grass and dragon. Interesting. <clears throat> okay. Well, look at that. Look at us. I could not tell what that was. It's a muck. Being weird. Oh, it's weird. It's cool, though. Now, you'll all have to point out shinies for me. Because I'm, I'm terrible with color and I can't see them. So if you see one, say something. And then 30 seconds later, when it shows up in the chat, I won't notice because I'll be in the middle of doing something and there's way too many messages to read them all. And then I'll get it. I defeated 10 wild Pokemon in battle, apparently. Go faster. Please. It's Oddish. I know Oddish. Do an Ocarina of Time Let's Play? I mean, at this point, I'd probably just stream it. I just, like, Let's Plays, like, they stopped being a thing. Everyone wants streams. I've had more people on this one stream than, like, any ep like, the views on any episode of a Let's Play I've ever done. <laughs> you know? People just don't watch Let's Plays, which is funny because I'm way more into Let's Plays. They're just so... I, I want the tighter experience, but I don't know. People want streams, so... Just giving the people what they want. Is this your base? You don't have, like, an inside? What about when it rains? It is true. I like the less editing. And that's why people are like, why don't you cut off the beginning? Or like, if something messes up on the stream, why don't you cut it off in the VOD? Because that would require more editing. That would require any editing whatsoever. And that's the thing is like, it is only worth it to like upload all of these if I can do it super quick. You know, it's just like, it's too much work. It's so much work that I just, I know I won't do it if I have to do anything extra. <laughs> it's the sad truth of it. Especially if it's a VOD and it's only, you know, like, one and a half thousand people are gonna watch it. Like, I, I can't, I can't spend that much time on it. Welcome to the Coastal Plaza, where the team that supports Miss Lacey of the Elite Four and your Arlo, right? One of the BB League challengers. Oh yes, I'm willing, I, here you go. It was tough scrounging this up, but I did it. It can't rain, you're in a terrarium, oh yeah. That makes sense. Thank you very much. Duly received and noted. 
We need you over here, Miss Hazy! Dude, just call me. Just call me. Text me. Oh, if it isn't Arlo, I'm so glad you decided to pay me a visit. Please follow me. I'll show you the trial site. Thank you for coming to the Coastal Plaza to challenge me, and I really am sorry for the way I protested you joining the BB League, Arlo. Honestly, I thought that you wouldn't get in, and you would leave, and I wouldn't have to have this awkward conversation with you. But here we are! Now we just kind of got to get through this. Next to the terrible looking flowers. With the flat texture. Of course, it's true that this is quite irregular under the bylaws of our school clubs, I must remind you. But mainly, I didn't want you to get dragged into the drama that's been troubling the- Oh, I'm sure. You just wanted to protect me. That's why you didn't want me in your club. Yes, what is the trial? Tell me. It's a quiz. It's a quiz? Oh, okay. That seems cheap to me. <laughs> seems really cheap. Okay, give me the questions. I'm a Pokemon pro is the thing. I'm a Pokemon pro. I'm friends with Loxton. That means that I'm automatically a pro. I, I... They call me the Pokemon... The walking Pokemon encyclopedia. That's what they say about Arlo. Uh, explain it again. What are the... You ask questions and I have to what? I have to... An oh, answer them. Oh, answer them correctly. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm re I, I get it now. It's a Pikachu. It's a Pikachu. It's yellow. It's a Pikachu. I know this. I know that one. I know this one. <laughs> Question one. All right, here we go. And look, it's everyone's favorite Pokemon, Pikachu, here to help. And with that, question one. Pikachu is an electric type Pokemon well known for producing electricity within its body. But in which part of its body does it store the electricity it generates? Go right for the body part that you think is cr Go right for it? What, just like hit it? Poke it? What do you want me to do? Go right for it. Unclear. Well, if I, uh, if I recall, if I look back to my training, uh, when I was a, a wee lad in middle school, watching the first episodes of the Pokemon anime, when they were airing on TV, I would say it is the cheeks. I know that. I knew that. Ding, 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 you got it. Pikachu stores its electricity in the electric sacks in its cheeks. If you poke the sacks, you get a little shock. But don't you think they're just super round and cute? Now then, I think we're ready to move on to our next quiz question. Dun it. Paper Mario style. That's Venonat. I know that one too. This is good. I know these. I know this. I'm a Gen 1-er. Take a look at Venonat here. Look at it. It's bigger than you'd like. Uh, bigger than you'd think it would be, isn't it? But it's also fluffy and squeezable and terribly adorable, really. It is cute. I do like Venonat. So here we go with question two. Even on the darkest of nights, Venonat is able to use a certain part of its body like a radar, which allows it to detect surrounding objects. Which part of Venonat's body acts like a radar? Well, I mean, if I'm just gonna use just uh, logic, common knowledge, uh, I would say antennae, even if I didn't know anything about Venonat, I was wrong. I was wrong. Wrong. I could, I was wrong. That was wrong. I do see why you think that, though. Yeah, okay. Wait, guess again. Doesn't that mean I lose already? I was just testing you. So... That doesn't make sense. Um... Don't I lose, though? <laughs> You said I had to answer them all correctly. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is a new one. I don't know this one. This is weird. This is strange. This isn't even real. Question three. Sinistee like to live in precious antique teacups. So the teacup isn't part of it. 
Then why do they all look the same? Where does it get the teacup? If that's not a standard teacup grown by this creature. That's confusing. That is confusing. But there are a lot of phonies out there. It's hard to tell which cups are genuine antiques. One of these three synesty is an antique form synesty, meaning it found a real antique cup. So which synesty has the real de How am I supposed to know? Uh, extending the pinky. That's really funny. Uh, this better not be something based on color. I ain't good at that. Okay, hold on. Look at the back. Okay. You guys turn too. There's the turn. Uh, they, uh, look the same. You turn again. One on the right. You turn again. Okay, no. Uh, uh, that one has a little thing on it. What about that one? It's got a thing on the bottom rim. Left one. Turn. Turn. Turn now, please. Yes. You have the thing. You have a thing. I got it. I got you. I got it. Everyone trying to spoil it. Who's spo Don't spoil it, chat. This is for real. I want to get into the BB Club legit. I want to... You gotta... You, I, I don't want to cheat. I love spot the difference. It's fun. They're all so darn cute. Falcon Blizz Zach, thank you for coming. Thank you for joining us. Merry Christmas. Mer well, Merry Christmas to you, too. You're sweet. You're so sweet. <laughs> the entire chat tried to spoil it. It's funny. Next question. I'm going to get this one. Another Gen 1. Or Gen 2. I'd accept. Nope. This is the Meteor Pokemon. Minior. Comes in all kinds of different colors, you know. You know, I really do like that thing. That is cute. I don't think I played the game that was in, though. I'll first ask you to take a good look at this pinkish mini ore for me, okay? Uh, alright. Oh. Alright, guys. Mix yourselves up real good. This is not really a quiz. This is, uh... Now we're ready for question four. Which of these pinkish mini or uh, which of these is the pinkish mini or I first showed you? Well, it's, you didn't even try. You didn't even try. That's not a quiz. <laughs> That's nothing to do with my knowledge of Pokemon. That was just a little game. They are cute. I do like them. Very last question. Oh, Grand Bull. I know that one. Gen 2. Oh, look, here comes Grand Bull. Maybe it heard the word pink and decided to stop by. Once a Grand Bull bites, it never lets go. Ever. This little sweetie is one of my own Pokemon. It's always with me. Our last question, question five, will involve Grand Bull here. Grand Bull is a quiet, delicate, and lovable Pokemon, of course, but you can tell. Can you tell me this? When I take a nap with my adorable Grand Bull, which part of its body do I use as a pillow? I think there's really only one option. It's not going to be big giant jaws. I'm going to say tummy. I use that soft, adorable tummy. When I cuddle up to it, it's so soft and cozy. We both fall asleep in just seconds. And that's the end of my quiz. You managed to get all five of my questions right, which means congratulations, we can fight now. We can fight now, I'd love to fight. Thank you for the super from Yee 
be Santa and ask us what we want for Christmas. What do you want for Christmas? I can't read them all, but like, yeah, why not? Go crazy. Tell us what you want for Christmas. I'm not Santa, so I can't give it to you, but I can hope that you get it from Santa. I'm getting too old. I didn't really ask for much. I think I asked for socks. Uh, I don't know if my Pokemans are all healed up, but why not? Let's go for it. Silk Song for Christmas? Yeah. A cube of uranium. Only if you're good. A new dirt bike. Sick. Pikachu in real life? Maybe. New Katamari Damacy? Wouldn't that be nice? Just looking forward to my family opening the presents I got them. That's sweet. That's sweet. Elden Ring DLC? Yeah. Not at the Game Awards. Not at the Game Awards. This new job you're going for? I hope you get it. I hope you get it. I mean, I say that. I assume that you'd be a good fit for it. Technically, I don't know. But I'm going to assume you are. <laughs> and say, I hope you get it. A sock full of smoke detectors. <clears throat> but I got you one of those last year. A spicy pickle. Ooh. Be good. I want someone to do a remix of the Arlo Carol. <laughs> yeah, it'd be fun. They should release a mod with you voicing over all the NPCs. I legit dream about that a lot. I think it would be a lot of fun. I thought about doing that for like Paper Mario or something. Just voicing all of the characters. I would do that. It would be so much fun. I don't know how to do that though, so not gonna happen. R Rutger, Rud Rudger, I've never known how to pronounce that. Nimir, I don't know how to pronounce your name. I'm really sorry, but thank you for coming by. Happy holidays from your 72nd sub? You're kidding me. You were my 72nd sub. Really? That means that you were around even before the Loxton collab. You are an OG fan. One of the, I, a couple hundred, couple hundred that subscribed to me just purely based on nothing other than stumbling upon my channel before I even collaborated with Loxton. That is impressive. It is very, very good to have you. I'm very pleased that you are still here because that is incredible. I, I wish I could round up that first like 250 people Throw a big party for him. <laughs> so thanks for coming. I'm really, I'm really happy you told me that. That's terrific. That's fantastic. I am Lacey of the Elite Four. I really didn't expect I'd get a challenge from someone, someone like me. What does that mean? What does that mean? Oh, different school. Okay, let's, let's, let's battle. Let's go. Fairy type Pokemon. I know all of the types that are good against fairy. All of them. Oh, you're just telling me. Okay. Of course, I was going to say poison and steel. I was going to say that because those are the obvious ones. Of course. But do you know uh, what's not good against them? I know, but you should remind me. <laughs> no, that's fine. I don't need you to tell me. I don't need to know. I already know. I know all my type matchups. Especially Fairy, the newer one, that I didn't play the introductory game that it was that it was introduced in. Especially that one. This time I'll be facing you with my usual party as a member of the Elite Four. Excellent. Good. Whimsicott and Granbull. Um, level 78. Okay. I have to try. I can't, I have to, I can't. <laughs> I gotta really, uh, I gotta try here. I can't mess around. Uh, what's good against <laughs> Fairy again? Uh... 
Anyone over the age of 28 don't know fairy matchups. Yeah, that's me. Fairy's immune to dragon. I needed to know that. Thank you. What about dark? Is dark extra good or is dark bad? I want to say dark has to be good, right? Has to be, because it's fairy. It's like, eh, it doesn't want to... Steel. I don't have a steel move yet. Uh, not here. Only weak to poison and steel? That's it? Very strong against dark. Okay. Dragon doesn't affect it. Poison and steel. Okay. Well, I don't have any of that. So, I guess ice. Guess we're doing ice. On, uh, I don't know. Uh, that one. And then, uh, steel. Hey. There you go. There you go. Smack that grand bull real good. Is it part grass? So ice is good. That's good. It's a rock solid strategy to go after weakness, which is why I okay, never mind. Crashing slowly! Thank you for the super. Hi Arlo, my kids and I love your videos. I was wondering if you could wish them a Merry Christmas. Their names are Zoe, who's seven, and Aiden, who's three. Well, Zoe and Aiden, I would love to wish you a merry, very merry, a very merry berry flavored Christmas. I'm very pleased that you are enjoying, while well, you didn't say you're enjoying, I'm very pleased you are watching my stream. <laughs> Zoe and Aiden, Merry Christmas. Love ya. Enjoy Christmas. Seven and three, I miss being seven and having Christmas. Oh, it sounds great. You enjoy it. Oh, you enjoy it. What happened to Bax while I was looking away? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, man. Oh, uh, that's all right. We got plenty. We got plenty of Pokemon here. Got plenty. We got loads. We got billions of them. Go, Michael. Get in there. Let's get you flip turned. Uh, we're gonna flip turn that grand ball, and uh, we're just gonna we're gonna smash that grand ball again. Well, uh, no, but they're doing the. Eh. I don't know. How about you stop? Have have you wind cap? Go for it. Just go. I don't know. Just do it. Thank you so much, there, ecstatic. Oh, that's wonderful. I'm glad to hear that. So we're flip turning out. Who can take it? Who can take the hit? Claude can take the hit. Claude can take anything. Maybe not a good idea to do Claude, because I might need that poison. Oh. Alright. Throwing a tantrum. Whoa, okay. Super effective, apparently. Prim Primarina. All right. Poison. I know poison. Poison is good. I'm gonna... Should I poison jab or should I go for the toxic? <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. I guess I don't know how hard it's gonna hit. I'm gonna go for the poison jab. I can't play the slow game here. If I've only got one, one uh, poisony po Pokemon. For a heavy slam, hopefully finish off that grand bull. Ha! Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. He's not actually gonna attack. <laughs> Use items. I'm not gonna do that. That's cheating. I really had a lot more fun when I stopped using items. Because you can just use items forever. You just always heal them. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm going to be bummed if Claude can't get even one more attack. A 
Okay, not going super great. Not going uh, the best. Let's, uh, I could, yeah, let's do that. That makes sense. Um, yeah, I, I guess just, uh, well... Will somebody please take out that Grand Bull? Please. You gotta. Thank you. Why would you do that much? Why would you do that much damage? Try held items. Oh yeah, that is a that's a real strategy. There is like really like trying to have good held items. I don't really do that. <laughs> I don't really bother. Oh come on! Aren't you gonna hold out so that I don't cry or something? Where's my luck? I feel like every time I'm fighting, it's usually just like every single time any Pokemon would faint. They get at least one chance. Ronin Let, thank you for the super. Longtime fan, just finished Pikmin 4, it was fantastic. Thank you, it was fantastic, wasn't it? That's a good game right there. Oh, it's a good one. Um, That darn Granbull. That darn Granbull. Michael, get him. Get him, Michael Finnegan. Begin again. That's not where the name came from, but... Now that's the joke I'm making. Okay. Here's the thing. Please defeat someone. Please just like... I don't know. Just like, beat them. <laughs> you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? How about, let's go for the thunder. Let's go for the thunder. Just do it. What's a lowland slow, bro, though? Am I, did I mess up my... My type matching. I know Slover is water, but. Good. Thank you. Thank you. I'm about to be swept by a pink dog. Thank you for it. Oh, you're kidding me. What is it? What? Is it poison? Is it like water poison? Where's it? What a fairy? I thought they were all fairy. Thought they were fairy. Poison psychic? Oh, poison psychic. Where's the fairy part? That's not fair. That's not fair. Ugh. It's not going well. It's not going great. But you know what? It's not going, uh, terrible. It's not going, uh, too, too bad. Uh Uh-huh. I I uh 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 Double target slow bro, you think so? You think so? I'll take that advice. Well the hydro pump Barely did. No, that I used thunder. Okay, yeah, I'll do hydro. Okay, sure, I'll do it. I'll take that advice. The light screen was reducing damage. Okay. Oh, okay. So thunder will do better now. Well, hopefully it lands. I don't know if it's gonna land. Oh no! Don't eat a nut. You stinker. Ah. Oh. Come on! Come on! Come on! No! 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 No, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, you did it. You did the thing. Thank you. I would have felt sad if you had failed. Yes. Oh, exit drill. Great. My allergies are going crazy. <laughs> you can really use this. Uh, ooh. Oh, super effective. Oh, I hope it goes first. I don't know if it's worth going for the Hydro Pump, because uh, it's less accurate, and I'm getting a little worried about that. 
YOLO. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah. No, don't do that, don't do that. No, 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 you don't want to do that. No. 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 Ah, oh, boy. Ah, oh, boy. It's alright, it's gonna be ground, right? That's fairy, that's not ground. That's not what I needed you to do. That's the opposite. What? They can tough it out when they're already at one HP? I have never seen that happen. Okay, hold the phone. Hold the phone. Has anyone else seen that before? Because they frequently tough it out and get to one, but they've never toughed it out twice in a row. I mean, he still ended up fainting, but like, is that a thing? Anybody? Is that a thing? I'm seeing a lot of no. Some yes, all the time. Never had that. Never seen that in my life. A lot of people say they've never seen that. It's the power of friendship. Maybe I'm just not loving my Pokemon enough. That's really crazy. It is broken. It's like the game is already easy enough, you know? Huh. I don't know how I've never seen it before. Even, even if it is a 10%, that's really surprising. <sighs> okay. Okay. Uh. Um. Uh. Okay. I don't I don't even I don't know. I don't even know anymore. I'm just gonna I'm just going for it. I don't even know what I'm doing. Giga drain. Power whip, earth power. Stun spore, maybe that would have been a good idea. Yeah. Let's uh let's uh I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I should be terastalizing. Yeah, he, we're gonna terastalize? Hydro pump. That guy. And then you, you're gonna. You're gonna power whip. That guy. Take him out. Take him out. Da 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 No, don't do that, don't do that. No, 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 you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. Yeah, that's a bad idea. Bad move. Bad play. You're going to pay for that. Oh, yes. Oh, but we doubled up. Oh, we doubled up though. That's bad. I didn't know it was gonna take him out. <laughs> darn it, darn it. Okay, we're fine. We're good. Mushy healed four HP. We're good. Oh, it still worked. Oh, does Hybrid Trump Hydra Bump do both? We're good. We're good. We got this. We ooh, we got this. We got it. A creamy is slow. So we got it. Uh, would it be safer to not go for the 80 accuracy one? I don't know. I mean, I haven't missed yet. I kind of feel like I'm due for one. Aqua Tail is so much... It's not actually that much less powerful at all. 
So yeah, I'll just do Aqua Tail. And then you... Uh... I don't know. Uh, yeah. That one. Go. Do it. Oh, come on. Aqua Tail also hits the lower defense. I knew that. On purpose. Did that on purpose. First try, no items. Seems I'm quite the uh, Pokemon master. I, if you, if I don't mind me saying, I think I did a pretty good job there. I know my stuff. All right, it's just, you know, it's whatever. It's whatever. Did you see? Did you see our Pokemon battling it out? I did. I was actually there. I don't know if you saw me. I was there, looking at the whole thing. Uh, yeah. Oh. Hmm. That would feel inappropriate. They were super cute. Hee <laughs> hee, for sure. Uh, yeah, okay. We can do the picture thing. If that's the thing you want to do. They're all scuffed up and passed out on the floor. Well, that was fun. So apparently her thing is cuteness. I don't know if you noticed. Yeah, did you see it with your eyes or your antenna? <laughs> That's good. <clears throat> Yeah, I'm pretty strong. See, see you later. Venonat hops away pretty cute. I like that. Yo, champ in the making. It's me, Drayton. That's one Elite Four member beat. Things are looking good for you. Lacey's all about cuteness, apparently. That's what helps her make her Pokemon stronger. She's so into her team, training the little cuties doesn't even feel like work to her. Wild, right? Me neither. Doesn't this doesn't feel like work to me? It's almost it's like a game. This whole thing is just like a game for me, you know? It's almost like I'm having fun. You know, Lacey's polite to everyone else, but she's really blunt with me. I wonder why. Maybe she hates you. <laughs> Maybe she thinks you're a jerk. Maybe she thinks you're mean and full of yourself. Or maybe she likes you, I don't know. That's it from me. Good luck with the remaining Elite Three. Uh, let's just get right to the next one. Why not? Who's next? Uh, I it, it just, I suppose it is appropriate to save him for last. We've got, uh, we've got her. Crispin. That name will forever make me think of Daddy Daycare. I don't know if you ever saw that. Crispin. Um. Let's 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 do this one. Steel. I am more familiar with steel. No, don't exit. Oh, it's a bad map. It's a terrible map. It's the worst. Map. Crispin. To the next thing.
Heal first? Where would be the fun in that? Did it not automatically heal me? No. Oh. No, no. No. It didn't. <laughs> it did not. Uh, that's okay. We'll heal when we get there. We'll be fine. No, jump, jump first. Ugh. I know that Pokemon. Its name is Seal. The big cave over there. It's that one. It's Snot Bear. Based on the little kid from Wind Waker. <laughs> There's a Cedra walking around on the land. His tail. This is a big old cave. Whoa, cool. Crystal cave. Charged stone cavern. Huh. Interesting. Uh, we'll check that out later, though. I, uh... I should heal. <laughs> I really should. Uh, is that not... Is this not one where I can heal? What is this? Why... Who is it? No? Okay, cool. Thanks. Really helpful. Helpful little thing here. Don't zoom out all the way. How did I get over here? Okay, uh, never mind. Just gotta awkwardly climb this mountain. Do we need more ice Pokemon, or is it just me? I feel like it's just every time there's ice and snow, it's just like the same, like, ten. Go! Climb! Why are you sliding and not climbing? This does... I'm trying to get over here, please. You think that's bad? Back in my day, we had, like, two ghost Pokemon! It stunk! Ghosts were so cool! There just weren't any! Back in Gen 1, there just kind of weren't any! It's like three! Can I... Here we go. Finally. Ice types are the smallest in the game. I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, there's just like barely any. It's always that pinecone one. Oh, rut, 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 garud, gar I'm sorry. I got here because of your Audio Technica, the headphones review. That was my first video and you genuinely wanted to find headphones. That's really funny. That's really funny. You were actually looking for a headphones review and you came upon mine. That was my first video I ever did. If anyone's wondering. Just a review of some headphones, because when I first started out, it was just like, whatever. Literally just whatever. Whatever I felt like doing, that was what I did. I was not a Nintendo channel. It wasn't even a gaming channel. It just kind of became that way, because that was what, I mean, you know, I'm most interested in. A review of headphones. <clears throat> what a grand, epic sight. This majestic landscape. No, don't fall. Don't fall. Looks like such a regular guy. Wow, look at that view. Incredible. Makes you think. The marvel of 
nature, the wonder of nature. <laughs> oh, it looks awful. It looks so bad. Look at those trees. Oh, it's funny, though. It's funny. We laugh. So we don't cry. I should save. I mean, I know it pretty much auto saves, but whatever. Chad moved to keep your old videos on the channel? Yeah. They're rough. Yeah, there was no Korok up there. That's really what I was thinking, I think. Let's do it. I'm here for the barbecue. Are you that guy who Kieran yelled at? So the last one was a quiz. Uh, is it going to be like a match three? What is it going to be? And within the quiz, we had the shuffle. So what's, an, what's another like simple mini game we can do? Uh, run through the hoops. Yeah, it's going to be run through the hoops. The decision to allow you to take on the league was irregular, an exception among exceptions. I was against it, as you know, I do, I remember. But the Academy allowed it, and their ruling is absolute. Therefore, I will carry out my duty as a member of the Elite Four, as flawlessly as I always do. You like, you like to be flawless, don't you? The Elite Trial I devised starts right here. Flying time trial. Need to fly around the skies of Terrarium while riding a Pokemon. Reach the goal. Am I going through hoops? Because I will laugh so hard if I'm going through hoops. Oh my... <laughs> oh boy. Sorry. I was wrong. Not running through hoops. Flying through hoops. How could I have been so horribly wrong? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh, slightly predictable. Slightly predictable. They really pulled out the, their, their real design chops designing these. Oh, Lucas Hen! Thank you so much for the super. How do you see the future of Pokemon now with this groundwork, then on better hardware, maybe bigger team, AI making dev easier, more Arceus features? I mean, I feel fairly hopeful. I, I feel like the technical problems are the biggest problems here. I mean, I, I think the next ones will be better. And I think the whole entire experience is going to go a lot smoother. If they just, like, they don't need to make it that much prettier. It just needs to run better. So, like, I'm feeling pretty hopeful. I, like, I loved Scarlet and Violet. I loved Arceus. So, like, there's... I'm looking forward to it. I know not ever. I know a lot of people are feeling a lot more pessimistic, but I, I'm pretty, uh... I think I'll be all right. All right. Yep. I'll go through the hoops. <laughs> I will. I can verify that I am ready. Except I don't know how to fly yet. Is this futuristic monster. Not surprising to you at all. Your name is Agius. Yeah, that's my joke. Chomp chomp snarf chomp. Always giving this poor guy stuff that makes him go blah. Try to reach going time limit. Uh, okay. 
You can fly freely in any direction using the left stick. Uh, okay. All right. Maridon is adorable. I'm really not a fan of the other one. It's okay, but like, I don't know. A big chicken. I get the feeling, like all Run Through the Hoops challenges, this is going to be extremely difficult. Oh, we just kind of started. Okay. No! Whoa! Why would you be opposite controls? That doesn't make sense. Do flight controls. I give up. This is too hard. Ah, uh, yes, this is, uh... <clears throat> I might miss some. I might miss some of these... Some of these hoops. Oh, they are Magnemite rings. That's cute. That's not the goal, is it? You can't not fly through the rings. <laughs> There's no... You can't not. They're right there. Flying through the rings to add time. That's not even... Ugh, whatever. Try not to make fun of the game too much. They're just too small. <laughs> that was tough. I only had 41 seconds left. I don't think it is failable. I don't, you'd have to, you'd literally have to try to fail that. The quiz was harder. I at least missed one of those. Ooh, is there a harder one? Or are we just going back to the... Okay, well. <laughs> I do feel elite. Yes, this is an elite trial. That was crazy. It was really just a tutorial, I guess. Just to teach you how to fly, I suppose. Uh, I do wish to begin. You are Steel. I don't know who's first in line, but who cares? <laughs> yeah, if you miss all the rings, you could probably still make it. Yeah, it's true. It concerns Kieran. What is he to you, Arlo? Honestly, I really don't know. We were, like, kind of friends, but now he's, like, kind of mean. So I don't really, like, uh, you know. For my part, Kieran is the younger brother of my dear friend Carmine. Something in him has changed. He is not his usual self. I find this deeply concerning. If possible, I want to be the one to help him. That being the case, I cannot afford to lose... Now, when you say we're going to have a mini therapy session here, when you say you want to be the one to help him, is this because you want the credit? Because I would have been more comfortable if you said, I want to help him. But I want to be the one to help him suggests that if someone else were to help him, you would not be as satisfied, and that seems a little selfish to me. Might just be me. Could have just been the way you worded it. I just wanted to... I just wanted to throw that out there. Because I also want to see him helped. I will not be displeased if I'm not the one to help him because I care about him more in this case than satisfying my own needs to help him. Our battle starts now. Sorry. <laughs> She's like, okay, let's, let's get to it, please. This is Arlo going hard. I'm all, I'm all about this stuff. 
psychology, metaphysics. What is consciousness? Let's get into <laughs> let's get into that. Okay, level seventy-eight. <clears throat> steel. Okay, what are we looking at? We got a skarmory, steel, steel flying. I assume. Doug trio. Oh, it's a lowland. What's a lowland Doug trio? Steel, steel ground. I have to wait the 45 seconds for chat to catch up. What is that? What is a Lowland Doug Trio? Therapy over battle now. Honestly, you think I could be a good therapist? I, if I, I've said this before, like if I, uh, if I was, I am only into creative stuff. Like it is the only job I ever want. Steel ground, thank you. Ground steel, perfect. <clears throat> the only job I ever want is creative. Like, that's just the way I am. I've never excelled at regular jobs. You know, like, I just, I, I, I have a hard time doing what I'm not passionate about. And so, but I've always wondered if I had to do something that was not a creative hobby kind of thing, what would I do? And I'm pretty darn sure I would be, I would be a therapist of some kind. I'm pretty darn sure I am genuinely fascinated by psychology. That is true. Thank you, Raimi. I do also have a cute fuzzy appearance. That would hopefully would uh, help soothe my patients. Both my guys are weak to steel. Predict Palafin will be the most important actor again. Well? Yeah. <laughs> That's all right. They got a, they'll, they can pull their weight. And Chunk's got a lot of weight to pull, so. Uh, steel ground. Uh, ice is good against ground. How is ice on steel? I don't think ice is good against steel. Yeah, I don't have anyone with any fire moves at all. Like, none. Absolutely none. Uh, dr 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 dragon, ice. What is ice on steel? Does ice do anything to steel? Or is that just like a non-issue? Because Skarmory's flying, and ice is good against flying, I think? <laughs> I think? <laughs> I don't know. Do Glaive Rush because it looks funny. To Glaive? Love it. Ice is not good for steel. Okay, we're gonna Glaive Rush. Uh, after this movie attacks on the user, cannot miss. And will inflict double damage on the next turn. Well, I mean, he's going out anyway, right? If he's already weak to steel, probably. Um. Ice type would just hit for neutral. I, it resists drag or ice fang, because then I'll at least get the stab bonus. What is happening? No. Oh, oh, are we good? Might be good. Uh, stream looks like it's working for me still. Are we back? No, even I was looking at the thing and it was doing the circle. I think we're good? Arlo thinking so hard it crashes the stream. Okay, we're good. All right. Uh, random hiccup, I suppose. No, I was just saying how at some point I got the idea in my head that fighting was good against steel because like they bend steel. And I don't think that's true, but I just can't get it out of my head. I <laughs> just can't. I also thought steel was good against steel. It's not though, right? Um. Fighting is good against steel? Is that true? That is true. Then why was I thinking it wasn't? See, I can't get it straight. No matter what. Wait, then why was everyone saying that the only thing I could do was electric and fire? Why would you, I got, I got, I'll do the hammer on.
Ah. Ah, man. Ouch. Rocky helmet. Hey, flinched. That's good. Hey, ah. So close. Uh, no more spamming union room numbers, please. Seen a little bit too much of that. Uh, okay. So what did I do? I did Ice Fang, and it did barely anything. Uh. Okay. That's not gonna land anyway. <laughs> okay. Just go for it. Uh, it does not, uh, matter. It does matter. So what's the most accurate? Uh, yeah. Heavy slam that dark trio. Darn. Sorry, Bax. Didn't get to do that sweet glaive rush. Oof. Oh no, your tangling hair slowed me down. Your luxurious hair. Um, alright, uh, I'm gonna... Let's get Michael out here. So we can, uh, flip turn. Penguinion. Uh, right there. And then, honestly, I don't, <laughs> I don't even know. It doesn't even matter. He's gonna, he's gonna. Steel water. Yeah, not, not great. The, gra the rock department. Uh, steel water. That sounds pretty good. Yes! Cheat and win! No! Come on! Oh! That was the miracle survival. Cruel. Just cruel. Um. Uh. Uh huh. I don't know. All right, what are we doing? Uh. Is it worth risking? It's only 70 accuracy on the thunder. It's already, the Empoleon's already double weak. Do you think a thunder punch would take it out? I am seven levels above it. Oh, ah, I don't know if I want to risk it. I feel like my luck is just threatening to run out. Doing the thunder. It's only single weak? I thought it's water steel. Why is that single weak? Electric is not super effective against steel. Why do I keep thinking it is? Maybe that's another one of the ones I just think it should be. That's annoying. That's annoying. Um. Uh, yeah, okay. We'll do Thunder. Go for it. And then Claude will use Earthquake on Skarmory. Just kidding. Um. Poison does not work against Steel. 
Ah, oh, darn. Ah, oh, darn. What does Bug do? Does Bug do anything against Steel? I don't know. Whatever. Yes! Yes! Oh, come on. No, finish it off. Well, at least he's paralyzed. That's good. Yeah, okay. Should've used... No, I can't use Toxic. I can't use, I can't use anything. Claude can't do anything. Claude can't do a thing. Ah, oh boy. Ah, oh boy. Yeah, Claude can't do anything <laughs> against anyone. I ain't gonna swap. Might as well keep him out. Um... I kind of want to finish off the Empoleon. Yeah, I guess I should. Yeah, okay. Almost tempted to keep the Empoleon around because that way I just always have an opponent who's paralyzed. Just feel like it'd work out better, but no, getting through it faster is better. Yeah, Earthquake would be good, but it would hurt me too? Darn, it would hurt me too. Would that be a good idea? Um, how much damage would that do to Fuff? It would take out the Empoleon. It wouldn't do anything to the Skarmory. It's a terrible idea. Literally, all I can do is just Mega Horn again, <laughs> which is really stupid. Avoided the attack. Come on. It was already going to be a bad attack. You couldn't give me that. No. Oh, you put down the, the rocks and then you make me switch out. Oh, wow. A real strategy there. A real strategy. A true combo. <laughs> Ru Ru Nicholas. Oh yeah, okay. That is not a Pokemon I know the name of. Oh boy. All right. Uh Uh should I drain punch the Ru, Ru Nicholas or the Skarmory? Aquatail the bird. Is that everything? Oh, it's Psychic type? Oh. Let's do that. And then I don't want to switch Claude. He's, I mean, he's got to... He's got to come around sometime, right? Although I guess while he's out, he's not supporting his teammate. I guess that makes sense. But then the other person is just going to take... Whoever switches out is just going to... Take a hit. I don't want to take a hit. So I am going to Mega Horn this, which is a good idea and not a bad one. Not a bad move. Not an objectively poor play. Avoid it. You... What the heck? Why are you... Why is it missing? No! Stop with the... Well, hey, I get a free switch, I guess. I'll take that. It's basically a wasted move on your point. I, I just take a little damage from the rocks. Oh, boy. Uh, okay. Uh, I 
finish you off. And you will uh... finally get rid of that Skarmory. Oh man. That did some. Uh, hey, Perlaris, Perlaris, that is good. It's a trick room, it's not real. The dimensions have been twisted. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that does, I'm sorry. Okay. Um. Uh, yeah. He's already in. Right, of course. Uh, uh, yeah. Trick room makes it so instead of turns going fastest to slowest, they go slowest to fastest. Okay, that's interesting. Too bad Chunk isn't still around. Scizor. I love Scizor. Um... What does grass do against steel? I'm pretty sure it's like quadruple effective. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I think so. Um, uh, yeah, don't have levitate though. Please just don't have levitate. Just don't do that. No, don't use Aerial Ace. It's a bad idea. Come on. Ooh, not terrible. Not terrible. Not great. Not great. <laughs> don't stop. Don't heal anymore. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh What did I do last time? Yeah, I don't know. Fine, sure. Just yeah, go for it. Just do it. You're annoying. No! 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 Uh This is not good. Not good. How many does she have left? Uh, okay, bringing Claude back out, the one who can't do anything. Oh good. Oh good. One of the weakest Pokemon there is. Oh boy. This is it. This is it for her. This is it. We can do it. We get rid of the ridiculous. The ridiculous, ridiculous. And then we're good. We're good. We got this. Never mind that Meta Metagross Gross is like psychic and steel. Never mind that. <laughs> Never mind that at all. We're gonna. We're gonna Mega Horn. Uh, uh, that one. <laughs> and we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna terastalize, and we're gonna thunder that one. I should have terastalized Claude because then he would have only been ground type instead of psychic, instead of poison. So the psychic wouldn't have. Ah, darn it. Oh, I should have teared Claude. Yeah, that was a bad, bad move. Bad. Hey, no Fs yet. We don't know. We don't know that this is a loss. We got this. 
Yeah, exactly. Mega Horn is neutral to Mega Gr See? I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Big misplays. You! Have, have faith. Yeah. Thought it was neutral. Oh, because he... Yeah, because he terrestrialized. Okay. Ha! Missed me. Missed me. Now you must kiss me. Oh, yes. Ooh. Ooh, we got it. We got it. We got it. No items. No items. Makes it too easy that I can just spam hyper potions forever until I win, and then I won't feel good at all. Oh, I still got nothing against that thing. I don't want an earthquake. That's gonna hurt Fuff. If uh, if Fuff faints first, I don't know if I've ever seen that with the axe. That's kind of cool. We're good. We're good. We're gonna mega horn as uh, critical, and then. Uh, and then uh, we're just, we're gonna thunder. We're just gonna roll of thunder, hear my cry, here we go. Critical hit, boom, not critical. That's okay. They can't all be critical hits, no! <laughs> I didn't want it to be critical hit on him, no. I wanted him to stick around so I could use, uh, use the big boom with the earthquake on him. Get him, <gasps> yes! That did it. I don't know how. I don't know how it did that much damage. I guess it's because the terrestrializing. Boom. Got it. I got it. Undersky, thank you for respecting my decision because you know what it worked out in the end. Worked out in the end. Uh, yeah, yeah. Woof. Got him. I am not enough. I see. The clutch. Fuff clutch indeed. I was getting lucky with landing all those thunders. I didn't miss any thunders. I don't understand why. Yeah, Fuff really carried that battle. Really did. The strength of one's Pokemon. Yeah, okay. That's all right. Okay, I know. Your desire to help Kieran is evidently greater than my own. Okay, we'll see... You just brought that back in. If you want another little session here. We weren't talking about Kieran. You brought that back up again. And once more made it about yourself. You framed that. Like you used this to... that. That's, that's unhealthy. <laughs> you got that right. <laughs> oh, you can't plenty. Definitely need to stream Pokemon more because I, I played a lot of Scarlet and Violet and there were so many exciting battles and I really wished that I could share them, but I didn't even like, I couldn't record them or anything and I just really wish I could have. So like, I definitely need to stream more Pokemon. This is fun. This is too fun. Time for a photo. And you guys can help me with the type matchups and stuff. <laughs> You'd be hard pressed to find a better TM than that one. Time for me to go. So long. Good outro. Looks at clock. Time for me to go. Bye. Uh, I am enjoying this a lot more than Teal Mask so far. If anything, just because there are fights with high-level Pokemon. So that's two Elite Four members. I am. I'm crushing it. First try on both, too. Thing about Amorous is, as rigid as she looks, she's got a sensitive streak a mile wide. Remember about her, okay? Even if it's hard to tell from the outside. You're telling me people can have different feelings on the inside? Why does hair perk up like that? They're not ears. I was getting worried. I'd be so dis it'd be so disappointing if Arlo had gotten weaker. 
But you seem as strong as ever, thankfully. Go all the way. Don't go losing. Don't go throwing Pokeballs. I can't show you how strong I've gotten if you don't even make it to me. Someone's good and riled up. Yeah, I guess so. You can tell by his fanny pack. Anyway, you got places to be, right? Better not keep you. See ya. Ah, excellent. Excellent. This has been much fun. And I wish I could continue, but I have to go and do other things. I have to do other things today. I have to balance this with uh, other work stuff. I gotta get stuff to Kane. We got, oh man, so much to do. Oh, I wish I could just keep on streaming this all day. That'd be fun. Especially because I don't know when I need to keep playing this. I need to like burn through it so I can do a review on it. But this has been really fun and I bet there's probably at least some people here that would like to keep watching me stream this. Um, so I don't know. I don't know. Gotta think. Cause like, you know, streaming, it takes longer to play. It's harder to like just burn through it. But it's fun to stream. I am seeing some people who'd like me to keep streaming. This, this game. Yeah, well, I definitely can't play more right now. I really do have to go. I'm also quite hungry. And I gotta write scripts. I gotta do ooh, all sorts of stuff. Um, it's been your first stream? Yeah, my pleasure. Thanks for coming. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year, all that stuff. I'm gonna try. I'm, I'm gonna try to stream this again. I do not know when. I cannot give you a number. So you'll just have to turn on notifications or whatever. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'll let you know. I'll, uh, and I'll, if I can announce it on Twitter, I will. I don't know if I can, though, because, like, I, you know, I'm getting tired of saying I'm going to do it and then something coming up, so I <laughs> really should just start streaming. Streaming earlier in the day, I really get a good big crowd. Apparently a lot of people are, I, I always assumed that nighttime would be better, but uh, we, got, we got a lot of people. This is it good? Uh, I love you all. I had a really great time. Really super great time. Thank you all for coming. And I'll, uh, I'll see you later. I'll catch you later.